can't support us, completed Novel House in link below clip. Thank you for come in and love the sharing story, Chapter 261. Good relationship, the next day, Wang Li's man and child arrived. Wang Li specially asked for a day off. The father and son were only staying for one night. Wang Li did not come back that day. She went out to the guest house to accompany them. After all, they got just one day. And when Wang Li sent the father and son back, she was in low spirits. What is there to be depressed about? You'll graduate soon. Your family can stick together every day then. Lin Qing, he smiled. Being teased by her, Wang broke into a smile. Lin Qing, he nudged her with her shoulder and continued teasing, look at the blackness under your eyes. Afraid you didn't sleep a wink last night. Wang Li's face flushed immediately. Coughing dryly, she responded, fellow Lin Qing, he, your thoughts aren't pure. I'm not pure. You are the purest. Lin Qing, he laughed. Wang Li couldn't stop herself. She burst into laughter. The smile was full of happiness. Lin Qing, he was very emotional. Since they were her best friend's husband and kid, she had gone once to get to know them. Wang Li's man looked like a black bear. Ordinary in appearance and large in size. Almost 1.8 meters tall. Not much shorter than Zhou Qing Bai. In fact, in Lin Qing, he's eyes, he wasn't worthy of Wang Li. Wang Li was pretty. She was also smart and capable. Not to mention her education. However, she had no regrets. When seeing her man and son coming over, the joy seemed to shine on her face. That was only one point. When that man saw Wang Li, Wang Li was like the world in his eyes. Based on this alone, Wang Li wouldn't worry about being betrayed in her life. You don't know. When we entered the countryside, the days were completely different from what we imagined. During that time, the days were really difficult. Wang Li talked about the past. They all went to the countryside in a very excited and thrilled mood. But in the end, they were awakened by reality. It was really difficult. Many female educated youths secretly cried at night. Although she didn't cry, life was really hard. Later in her twenties, she married. She married her current husband. He really loved her. He basically didn't need her to do any chores at home. In the beginning, Wang Li was not very satisfied with him. Still, she had to accept it. The human heart was also made of flesh. A man treated her so well and was also her husband, how could she not gain feelings? Whenever he got some good food in his hand, he couldn't bear to eat it himself. He would leave it all for her and let her eat more. When it was cold in winter, he urged her to put her feet on his stomach to warm her feet. Even when she was pregnant, he was tolerant of her temper. Also one time, her mother-in-law and others didn't allow her to participate in the college entrance examination because they were afraid that she would get admitted and leave. It was her man who supported her. Wang Li felt that she couldn't find another man who treats her well like this in her life. In addition, she wasn't fickle-hearted. Naturally, the relationship between husband and wife was excellent. Last night, cough cough, she was certainly busy. Wang Li had a beam on her face. Lin Qing, he smiled when she saw her like that, smiled enough? If you smiled enough, then open the textbook. You have to make up for yesterday's day off. Wang Li quickly listened to Lin Qing He's explanation. Lin Qing, he finished teaching her, and said, I wonder if there is any exchange meeting in High City this year? Ask the tutor. Wang Li wasn't clear either. Lin Qing, he came over to find her tutor. Her counselor grinned, there may be one this year. Do you want to go? If there is a chance, I want to participate. There are many things worth learning. If I work for the school in the future, I can use it as material for the students in our school. Lin Qing, he responded. Her tutor nodded, if there is a chance, I will let you know. Lin Qing, he continued on, teacher, I may have to trouble the school to help with the relocation of my family's household registration in the future. It's our duty. 
If you are willing to work for the school, the school must help your family solve the household registration problem. Can't let you be separated from your family at a young age. Her tutor had her own family and understandingly replied. Thank you, teacher. Lin Ching, he sincerely bowed to her. You're welcome. Her tutor smiled deeper, if you work for school, I will also have face. I have a new book. Come with me to get it. Okay. Lin Ching, he responded cheerfully. After coming to the office, her tutor gave her the material. Lin Ching, he spoke, I will bring it back to teacher within a week. Take your time. There's no rush. Her tutor said. Lin Ching, he took it. This material was indeed excellent. Lin Ching, he held it eagerly and started learning. Lin Ching, he's memory was truly excellent. She didn't feel tired. In the nutrition aspect, perhaps it was due to Zhou Kai delivering two eggs a day. Just give me one a day. You can eat the rest yourself. Lin Ching, he only wanted one and said. It's just two eggs. You won't get fat. Zhou Kai knew that his mother was afraid of getting fat, assured. Lin Ching, he said, is there anything you don't understand in English? Yes. Zhou Kai nodded. Then he listened to his mother's teaching while eating eggs. After Zhou Kai understood it thoroughly, Lin Ching, he sent him away, so he won't disturb her study. Mother, milk will be delivered tomorrow. I ordered two bottles. Let's have one each. Zhou Kai said. When you get it, send it to me. Lin Ching, he didn't refuse. The milk at this time was veritable fresh milk. Although she got a good memory, her nutrition needed to keep up. So a bottle of milk a day was fine. Zhou Kai acknowledged it and then went to play basketball. This kid's grade was great, so Lin Ching, he wasn't too strict. Don't look at his height. He was only 15 years old this year. In the early years, she pushed him over the line in order for him to make it in time for university. Now she let him do what he wants, as long as he didn't do bad things. She was such a big-hearted mother. She probably won't change in this life. Lin Ching, he had a good memory and excellent comprehension ability. It took about 10 days to fully understand this information. When returning the materials to her tutor, her tutor was also surprised. After testing her a bit, she knew that her student truly had the talent in this area. So at the end of April, her tutor came over to chat with Lin Qinghe. She asked her if she wanted to continue her studies. No plan. I plan to end my studies ahead of schedule tomorrow. I'll take on teaching class and then bring my man and children over for a family reunion. Lin Qing, he smilingly answered. Her tutor wasn't too surprised about her early graduation. This student's grades had no faults at all. She just loved her family too much. Family-oriented was always much better than some people who abandoned their husbands and children. Chapter 262 Pocket money, it must be said that the incident between Qin Shui and her husband had a big impact on the school. How one handles their marriage was one's freedom. Others can't interfere if they want a divorce. As long as it wasn't overboard, it didn't have one's impression. Her tutor liked how Lin Qing he was. Her thoughts weren't too traditional, but still adhered to the principle. Women who take care of the family were always good women. In early April, the school organized another exchange meeting with High City's side. However it wasn't about English, but about mathematics, physics, and chemistry. Lin Qing, he lamented that she couldn't go. While Zhou Kai participated. He majored in mathematics and geography. He was also involved in other subjects. His results were excellent too. So he joined in. Before he went, he reported to his mother and asked her if she wanted to buy anything. Lin Qing, he had no needs. A female dorm mate in her dorm made a request to buy a new scarf. Seeing that she was his mother's dorm mate, even when their friendship was average, he still agreed. She lived in the same dorm as his mother after all. 
Lin Qing, he didn't have anything to get. She did give him a little pocket money so that he could buy whatever he liked over there. Zhou Kai came back after going there for a few days. He passed the scarf to that dorm mate and then he pulled his mother aside. He whispered, Mother, the last time you bought the watch, did someone cheat you? I went to check it. The watch you bought me last time is only 100 or so. Didn't get cheated. Lin Qing, he raised an eyebrow. Zhou Kai was shocked. Seeing his mother like this, he lowered his voice and said, Mother, tell the truth. Are you doing private selling? Smelly brat, not learning well. Lin Qing, he pinched his ear, how can you think of your mother like that? She had committed it, but she couldn't let her son know. It was not that she was worried that he could not accept it. The son she brought up had a strong mental mind. She was worried that he'll become bold and copied her. She owned a space, so she wasn't afraid of anyone investigating. She can't let her son do it. Mother, please don't hide it from me. I had an inkling in my heart long ago. Back in our village, our family had so much meat. Every time after the summer harvest was harvested, you had to transport grain to my aunt, Zhou Xiaomei. Those were all transported to the black market, right? Zhou Kai whispered. I think you owe a beating. Lin Qing, he glared. Mother, I am your biological son. What's more, I'm this big. I can think. Zhou Kai said. Lin Qing, he scolded in amusement, pay attention to your study. I, your mother, will not do anything shady. Otherwise, your father, that old antique, will be the first to disagree. Father is not the same father as back then. He was corrupted by you. Zhou Kai smirked. In the past, his father might forbid it. But afterward, whatever his mother said was what goes. There was no room for objection. Don't think about those whatnots and study hard. After graduation, do you still want to join the army? You can't have a still stain you. Lin Qing, he warned seriously. Mother, we are all grown up. You don't need to do this anymore. In the future, our brothers can support you. You don't need to work so hard. Zhou Kai answered seriously. Although his mother won't admit it, he knew it in his heart. And even if she profit, it wasn't too much. After all, it was from High City. How can it not be expensive when brought to County City to be sold? How much did it cost to go back and forth? How much time and manpower was spent? Zhou Kai felt that his mother had contributed to the family's good conditions. I don't need you to support me. Your father can afford to support me. Do you know how much retirement pay your father brought back when he retired? You just guess I did that kind of thing. Lin Qing, he grumbled. How much retirement pay can there be? At most, a thousand. Zhou Kai said. Three thousand. Lin Qing, he indifferently glanced at him. Zhou Kai was shocked to the core, father came back with three thousand yuan? At that time, the brothers were still young. And it was ten years ago. Not to mention ten years ago, even now, three thousand dollars was definitely a big sum. That's right. Lin Qing, he said, your father won't lie about this. You can ask your father when you go back. Really no shady business? Zhou Kai was close to believing her. I already said there's none. You insist on putting a hat on me? Lin Qing, he glared. Zhou Kai laughed it off and said, How much money is left now? Enough to spend. Lin Qing, he waved her hand. At the end of last year, she made a lot of money. Although she spent some to collect things like precious metals. Still, she didn't have much to spend. She had nearly 6,000 in her space now. Not only did the 3,000 yuan in the past not decrease, but it doubled. What's more, this was on the premise of her being extravagant. Mother, I brought this back. I don't have a familiar path. You can figure it out. Zhou Kai took out a watch and said. Lin Qing, he understood when she looked at this woman's watch. She was a little curious, 
and voiced out, where did you get so much money? I earned it myself. Also from the money, you gave me, mother. Apart from milk and learning materials, I have no other place to spend money. I brought all of it with me this trip. Zhou Kai said. So he bought back such a watch. Stinky boy, only this time. There's no next time. Lin Qing, he stared at him. I understand. Zhou Kai said, Mother, give me some money. I need to pay for the milk tomorrow. Lin Qing, he passed him ten yuans. Zhou Kai was used to his mother's generosity. He thought that his classmates were similar to him but later discovered that they weren't. Even his classmate from the capital, Wang Guiliang only received five dimes at most. Only his mother was unique. She can give ten yuans. It was a giant pit. Luckily, he was such a sensible son. If not, it would be too easy to raise a prodigal son. Zhou Kai shook his head and left in reflection. What do you mean by that expression, smelly boy? Lin Qing, he muttered. Then she went back to the dorm. As for giving Ten Yuan pocket money to the eldest son who was attending college, Lin Qing, he really didn't find it odd. Even if this era used a point system, Ten Yuan was still a huge sum of money. After all, most people's salaries were only about 30. It was still that phrase. Clash in concept. She truly found it normal to give her eldest son Ten Yuan to manage on her own. Since there was nothing else, Lin Qing, he got back to the dorm. As for the watch, she put it away. Once she returns to her hometown on a summer break, she'll resell it. Qing He, I must truly thank your son. I really like this scarf. Her dorm mate was over the moon. It's great that you can like it. I was worried about his taste. Lin Qing, he replied politely. She recalled that Sister May asked her to bring a few. Not a big problem. When the summer vacation comes, she'll go to High City first. Then head directly back to her hometown from High City. After all, she has to buy some goods to resell. Chapter 263 Zhou Qingbai came to visit, there was no more free time now. The days at school were indeed very busy. This year, her hometown had changed greatly. First of all, educated youths returned to the city. Many educated youths had gone back. Some have returned through their own channels, while others had yet to return. They temporarily stayed behind, but it was obvious that they will not stay for too long. Because of the current circumstance, they sensed it was only a matter of time before going back. People in the village were ill at ease. Still, the overall productivity wasn't affected. The biggest change in the village was that the number of chickens being raised was doubled. Father Zhou stopped working in the field this year. He herded the ducks to the river. Lunch was sent over by Mother Zhou. There was no need to bring them home for the whole day. He found a place to chill around. In the evening, he herded the ducks back. They were currently only a half-matured duck and still can't lay eggs. When they grow up, he'll have to pay attention to prevent them from laying the duck eggs outside. Originally, they planned to raise only four five, but Father Zhou felt it was too few and not worth the effort. So he straightforwardly took on seven eight. It didn't cost the family any supply to feed them. Just drive them out and let them feed on small fish and shrimps in the river. If they have to cut you the tail, then cut it. In addition, Zhou Qingbai didn't object. So, he ended up raising so many ducks. There were also a lot of chickens in the backyard. It was the same for everyone else in the village. No one can criticize another. As for those with ill intent who went to report it, nobody bothered with it. After all, Zhou Jia village wasn't the only place that did this. Since the Gang of Four collapsed, it wasn't the same as before. When Zhou Qingbai came back from the field, Er Hua and San Hua just finished cooking and said, Father, the bacon and sausage left by my mother are all finished. From today on, we have to tighten our belts to live. Before their mother left, she made a lot of bacon. It can last long. 
they were prudent when using it. That's why it was used recently. Zhou Qingbai said, tomorrow, there will be meat. He had already ordered with Sister May and will pick it up in the early hours of this evening. So they may do today. A scrambled egg, a cabbage, and mantu. That was it. It was still pretty good. Of course, when compared to the time when their mother was home, it was far from it. Mother Zhou portioned out Father Zhou's share first and then she ate first with her son and grandsons. It wasn't too late to deliver it after eating. Father, when are you going to see Mother? Sanwa asked at the dinner table. Are you free these days? Mother Zhou turned to look at her son. Not free. Zhou Qingbai shook his head. He did want to go to see his wife, but the spring plowing season was a busy period. It took up so many days to travel over and back. He definitely can't go. But if it rains, he can make a trip. After all, it sometimes rains for seven or eight days. Perfect to go back and forth. Zhou Qingbai looked forward to rain now. Well, what do you, his desire was answered. At the end of May, the weather started to become cloudy. Chapter 264 Properly dote, the couple hadn't seen each other for so long and now they were like this again. What else needed to be said? The two naturally got intimate. After it became calm and tranquil, they didn't mind the heat and sweat. Lin Qing, he chatted, I'm planning to go back when my vacation arrives next month. The days at school passed very quickly. It was June in the blink of an eye. The vacation was in July. There was one month left. Go back next month then. Zhou Qingbai said with his arms around her. Lin Qing, he knew that he missed her. Otherwise, he won't rush over like this. It was clear she was in a very good mood. Is everything okay at home? Lin Qing, he continued on. All is good. Don't worry. Zhou Qingbai replied. Now the policy was getting looser and looser. For example, this year, many people in their hometown had raised a lot of chickens and ducks. These were all unregulated. Soon, there will be better policies. You don't have to worry about us, mother and son. Lin Qing, he said. I'm worried. Zhou Qingbai stated. Lin Qing, he raised her face to look at him. Zhou Qingbai's gaze toward her was extremely soft. Lin Qing, he leaned forward and kissed him, have you rest enough? Upon hearing this, Zhou Qingbai understood what it meant. The two stayed in the guest house until the evening. They went out to have a meal together and strolled around the capital before returning to the guest house. Early the next morning, Zhou Qingbai had to leave. Lin Qing, he had sent him. She gave him several big meat buns for him to eat on the road. The couple reluctantly bid goodbye to each other. It was only when the train was about to depart, Zhou Qingbai got on the train. Lin Qing, he came back by herself. Zhou Kai had been waiting for a long time. As soon as he heard his mother was back, he came over at once. Mother, didn't my father come yesterday? Zhou Kai said hurriedly. Yesterday, when he came back, he heard from his classmates that someone sought his mother. He immediately went out to ask the security uncle who guarded the gate. Then he learned that it was a man looking for his mother. Listening to the uncle's description, beside his father, who else could it be? According to Zhou Kai's intention, the family will have a reunion since his father came all the way. A meal together in a big restaurant was a must. But who knew? His father and his mother left by themselves and didn't wait for him at all. He, Lin Qing, he didn't remember until now that she still had a son. She told him, your father went back. Zhou Kai said, I knew it. You two must have forgotten me. Hurry up to class. Lin Qing, he waved her hand and then returned to the dormitory. Wang Li was in the dorm. The rest had classes. Wang Li had none. When she saw that she had returned, she immediately copied how Lin Qing he made fun of her before, oh, there are dark circles under the eyes. Must have been a busy night. It's not much. 
Only seven times. Lin Qing, he said. Seven times? Wang Li almost choked to death by her own saliva. This was a bit too powerful. Lin Qing, he looked calm and opened the book to review her own knowledge. Wang Li looked at her and said, Aren't you going to rest? Not tired. Enjoying it. Lin Qing, he continued to act immodestly. Wang Li erupted into laughter, Have you no shame? We're best friends, Lin Qing, he didn't mind at all. As for seven times a night, that was naturally bragging. Lin Qing, he had no doubt that Zhou Qingbai had that ability. However, he traveled all the way over, they can't just focus on this kind of thing. It was just that the impulse was evoked. Despite doing that, they hugged each other and talked more. Also, she didn't want him to be too tired. He had to take the train. How could she really squeeze Zhou Qingbai dry? Wang Li was just teasing. She moved the topic to the coming test. Lin Qing, he guessed, the difficulty shouldn't be too high. Still, it shouldn't be too easy. About medium to upper level. Wang Li said, this time I can take a half day off after the exam. N. Lin Qing, he nodded. When reading, her mind was still on Zhou Qingbai. Zhou Qingbai got back to his hometown in a few days. The rain stopped the day before yesterday. Coming back today didn't delay anything. Because of visiting his wife, Zhou Qingbai's mood had improved a lot. When he came back, he worked hard. While the leader's mood wasn't very high, Zhou Qingbai didn't directly ask. Instead, he came back to ask his mother. Mother Zhou sighed, the leader's young son-in-law didn't get admitted to college, right? Well, this year a letter came from his family. He returned to the city. What about his wife and children? Zhou Qingbai frowned. Before he went back, he said when the other side is settled, he will come over to pick them up. No one ever came back to pick them up. Leader had been in a bad mood for a while. Mother Zhou shook her head. It was said that Leader's daughter was foolish. She stole the documents to return the city for her man and let him go back to the city. He left in the middle of the night. To sneakily leave, would he really come back later? However, Leader's daughter was certain that he would come back to pick them up. In the past few days, the Leader's wife scolded herself for raising her youngest daughter to this state. She regretted agreeing to let her youngest daughter marry an educated youth. How did your wife react? When you went over this time? Mother Zhou asked again. My wife was delighted. When talking about his wife, his expression had more cheerfulness. Chapter 265 Properly Dote Lin Qing, he, who was hailed as the best female fellow by the leader, achieved excellent results on the exam. Her tutor had reported to the university. The university welcomes students like Lin Qing, he, to stay and work at the school. Especially at present, the university was indeed in short supply of teachers. The results this time confirmed Lin Qing he's ability. By the end of June, the summer harvest will begin in the countryside. It was raining in the capital these days. It wasn't light. It was unknown what it was like at home. When the final exam was over, Lin Qing, he asked her eldest if he wanted to go back. He said he didn't, so Lin Qing, he let him be. After leaving him 50 yuan, she set out for High City at once. Since she came here, naturally, she'll buy things. It was summer. Although the village hadn't got electricity yet, the county did for a long time. Such things as electric fans were definitely selling well. Lin Qing, he went around several big shopping malls. From each place, she bought an electric fan as well as watches, scarves, and new clothes. She purchased nearly 2,000 yuan worth of goods in High City. Have to say, it made a big dent. Of course, it was also because the watches were too expensive. Lin Qing, he returned to her hometown with these things. When she took the train to the municipal city and sold a batch of things there. She didn't earn much. She directly gave it to the second-hand dealer. For example, a watch costing around 120. 
she sold it at 16070. Just a few dozen yuan's profit. Next in the chain, can sell it for 200. Even 230. It depended on their own ability. Like this, she got it off her hand quickly. Only three watches were left. They will be sold in the county at a price of 200. The rest were sold in the municipal city. Then Lin Qing, he caught the ride back to the county city. She came to the black market to sell electric fans. Then she sold the purchased clothes to Xing Yu from the supply and demand cooperative. Xing Yu tasted sweetness last year. Those scarves and clothes from last year had her earning almost three months' salary. Earlier this year, Lin Qing, he brought the kids into the city and came over to the supply and demand cooperative. Xin Yu was at work at that time. She pulled Lin Qing he aside and conveyed to her to give it to her next time if she got the goods. Xin Yu didn't hoard it by herself. She pulled another colleague, who also had a family, to work together. After the two were evenly divided the profit, they earned three more months' salary each. One can imagine how huge the profits were in this area. When Lin Qing, he came over, Xin Yu expressed she can take it on. The goods from High City were all new and trendiest. They will be on demand. On your side, you agreed. Discuss it with your colleague first. Seeing her like this, Lin Qing he said. Sister, don't worry. My colleague told me that, as long as there are goods, take as many as there are. Xin Yu whispered. The two's shift took turns. They can recommend a few sets a day. One item can make a profit of about two yuan. Splitting the few items' incomes, each gets a few yuan. The two of them were responsible for the fabric section. Their monthly salary had just risen to 30. Faced with such income, how can you not be moved? As for selling these things, there was a certain risk. But basically, there will be no big problems. When the guests came, both of them would explain that they had new styles of clothes from High City which their friends brought over. They don't want to wear them and ask them would they like it? They only made two dollars for one item. Even when Lin Qing, he made a good bit of profit as the middle person, it still wasn't expensive. Women who buy new style clothes won't stir trouble. So this work can be done. Even if it was reported, it was the same story. Generally, no one would report. When Lin Qing, he saw her saying this, she smiling gave her all the clothes. Not much, only two bags in total. Lin Qing, he gave her a list and said, this is the list I made. The pricey is on the top. When you get off work, let's go to your house to check it. Sister, wait for me. I'll go to my director's house to ask for leave. He's staying in the hospital today and didn't come. Xin Yu said hurriedly. Then I will wait at your house in trance. Lin Qing, he responded. All right. Sister, you go first. Xin Yu nodded. Her home wasn't too far from here. It was only around ten minutes away. Xin Yu went to the hospital to request leave and hurried back. Lin Qing, he was already waiting for her at the door with two bags. Xin Yu's two children were minded by her mother-in-law. She gave her some money every month. There was no conflict. As for her man, he hadn't gotten off work at this time. He was still in the bureau. As for this house, it was the one Lin Qing, he helped to find it. Xin Yu opened the door and let her in. Lin Qing, he was anxious to go home, so she stock-checked the item with her. In the past few years, the couple had also saved a lot of money, so she paid Lin Qing, he the money up front. Keep it for now. After you sold it, you can pay me then, Lin Qing, he urged. No need, sister. If you got some next time, just remember to bring it to me again. Xin Yu replied with a smile. How many days had it been since last time? Almost three months of salaries entered their hands. How could she be willing to lose this fat sheep? From her reaction, Lin Qing, he no longer refused any more and received the money. She spoke, then I will go back first. Okay. Xin Yu sent her out. 
Lin Ching. He originally planned to come over to Zhou Xiaomei to borrow a bike. Unexpectedly, a tractor was heading to the next village, so Lin Qing he carried the supplies she bought from the supply and demand cooperative and a big watermelon and returned home. It was only early July. The village was still very busy. They were all engaged in the summer harvest. The summer harvest was undoubtedly hectic. When Lin Qing he came back, there was no one at home. The door was locked. Fortunately, Lin Qing, he had the key, so she was able to enter the house. It was early evening, around half past five. Neither the children nor Zhou Qingbai was home. Same for Father Zhou and Mother Zhou. Lin Qing, he understood he was busy. On days like summer harvest and autumn harvest, it was almost like fighting for food with God. Unless they can't get out of bed, they have to participate. Father Zhou and Mother Zhou, who didn't participate in labor anymore, still helped at this time. Lin Qing, he didn't intervene that much. She put down her luggage and started cooking. On a busy day like the summer harvest, Lin Qing, he let the dough rise properly and then steamed the mantu. She cooked some side dishes. Scrambled eggs with cucumber and tomato and egg soup. Seeing some meal in a pot, she killed them and stewed it with pickled veg. The brothers, Erwa and Sanwa, came back first. They want to come back to cook. Don't know when it began, the family's meals were all made by the brothers. Killing eel or something, they knew how to and was quite adept and quick. Mother Zhou went out and had a good bout of praising. There was no daughter in the family. Still, the boys were also very useful not inferior to a daughter. Since the people in the village can no longer target Dewa, they start to eye on their brothers. Chapter 266 Supplementary Air Wa and San Wa saw their mother as soon as they got home. The two brothers were naturally surprised. Mother, why are you back? Air Wa said happily. I thought mother, you would come back later. San Wa also said. Lin Qing, he hadn't seen her two mischievous boys for almost half a year. She was naturally happy to see them growing up. On summer break now. So I took the opportunity to come back. Summer harvest has always been very busy, so I came back to cook for you. Whoever I neglect, it would never be the one who put the most effort in our family. Lin Qing, he cheerfully replied. Er Wa and San Hua grinned. You're hungry, right? Go grab two pastries to cushion your stomach. Lin Qing, he said. Since she got a space, she also brought some stuff. Some local specialty from the capital, but because of the hot weather, the roast duck wasn't taken out. There were a few in her space. She kept it for Zhou Qing Bai as a supper. Lin Qing, he, who didn't realize that she was excessively spoiling her man, started to stew pickled vegetables and eel. Mother Zhou came back early. She was also delighted to see Fourth's wife's return, last night I told old Fourth that you'll come back soon. I didn't expect you to return today. Then she noticed there was no bicycle and asked, why didn't you borrow the bike from Xiaomei? It's a long way. There happened to be a tractor returning to the neighboring villager. I came across it, so I just hopped on and didn't go to Xiaomei. Lin Qing, he answered. Mother Zhou nodded. Lin Qing, he turned to her two sons, give your grandmother some cakes to fill her belly. Sanwa went to get a piece and said, Grandmother, taste it. It's scrumptious. Mother Zhou smiled and said, I don't need to eat this. It's nearly mealtime. Still, she accepted it. Only Fourth's wife would buy such pastries and snacks. Sometimes she'll make them by herself. She, Mother Zhou, didn't know how to make these. In their generation, the craftsmanship can only be preserved as long as the family doesn't starve. My mother also bought a big watermelon back. After dinner, grandmother and grandfather don't rush home. Sanwa continued on. Your mother is back, are you happy? Mother Zhou ate the cakes and laughed. Of course. Sanwa proudly responded. 
Then, he was sent by his mother to feed the chickens and ducks in the backyard. Lin Ching, he asked, while cooking, Mother, why did you raise so many animals this year? She had seen several ducks and ten hens when she came back. Quite a number. The policy had changed this year. They don't care about it anymore. Mother Zhou explained, last year, after the old duck soup you made, your father raised more this year. Initially, I didn't want to raise so much. Lin Qing, he smiled and said, then keep it for our own family for the end of this year. I will come back to make it again. All right. Mother Zhou merrily agreed. Look at Fourth's wife now, she was really satisfied in all aspects. She got such a good eye at the start and found such a good one for old Fourth, right? What Mother Zhou didn't know, the one she found was one that could truly ruin three generations. Father Zhou and Qing Bai Zhou didn't come back until about half past six. As soon as he came back and saw his wife, he froze. Immediately, Lin Qing, he saw the apparent joy in the man's eyes. You're back? Wash and prepare for dinner. Lin Qing, he smiled. Okay. Zhou Qing Bai replied and went to wash his face and hands before preparing to eat dinner. The dishes were the same. But somehow, Lin Qing, he's one tasted different. It always matched Zhou Qing Bai's taste. What's more, this guy was really hungry. It was no wonder, since he ate breakfast before dawn in the morning before setting off and worked until noon. He took a break to eat before continuing to work until this moment. Even Iron couldn't stand the beating. Eat more. There is no meat at home today. I'll go over and make reservations with Sister Mei later. Lin Qing, he said in distress and piled a bit more ill for him. Mother, don't just focus on my father. It's not easy for me and my second brother. Not only do we have to go home to cook, but also participating in the summer harvest. There is no other young men who are more capable than us. Sanwa declared. And, you eat more too. Lin Qing, he conveyed with her mouth as she continued to add food to her man's bowl. Father Zhou and Mother Zhou were basically used to it. They calmly ate their own food. After taking it all in, the old couple was also deeply relieved. The fourth couple's relationship was great. Although it was out of the norm and the children were already that big, it was still wonderful to be like a young couple. Father and mother, you should eat more. In this weather, you too must also pay attention and escape the heat when you're helping out. Lin Qing, he said to the two elderly people. Chapter 267 Studying taking in their behavior, Lin Qing, he said, sure, let them come over at four in the afternoon. I will teach them till five o'clock in the afternoon. At this time, she needed to start preparing dinner. It wasn't much trouble to guide her nephew and niece. Eldest sister-in-law and third sister-in-law were delighted. They insisted on leaving the eggs behind. When they went back, they sent Wu Anai and Zhou Yang to bring over soybeans and sesame seeds. Lin Qing, he had the two take the eggs back. If they didn't take them back, she won't teach them. So they obediently took the eggs back. Both got scolded by their mother. It's no problem to keep the eggs. Mother Zhou spoke. Lin Qing, he didn't want to take advantage of others. Her family didn't lack this bit of things. She replied, give it back to supplement eldest brother's and third brother's body. The three families didn't have it easy. She was just giving pointers. Not a big deal. When Mother Zhou heard her respond, she didn't say anything. She just gave Fourth's wife a higher rating in her heart. Lin Qing, he let Zhou Qing Bai know, rest at home. I will go to Sister Mei's first. All right. Zhou Qing Bai agreeably nodded. Lin Qing, he took the bike and came over to look for Sister Mei. She had also brought a few scarves with her. It was currently summer, but she can save it for winter. Sister Mei happily said, I really trouble you. What trouble? Sister Mei, I want a few jeans of pork. Lin Qing, he responded. Tell me. 
Sister May nodded. Pork belly, ribs, big bones, a pork stomach, and a large intestine. Sister May promised her, go over to the pig farm in the early morning tonight. Okay. Lin Ching, he nodded. Then she returned. When she got home, Zhou Qingbai had already washed up. As for Er Hua and San Hua, they went fishing, for eels, with the children of their age. Go nap a bit. Collecting pork at night. Lin Qing. He picked up and munched on the watermelon left for her as she said. Go take a bath. Zhou Qingbai stared at his wife. Lin Qing, he's face reddened. Then she gave him an eye roll and remarked, you're exhausted from a day's work. Not tired. Zhou Qingbai looked at her calmly. In the beginning, he was drained. But his wife's return today had him feeling rejuvenated. Not a bit tired. Have it. Lin Qing, he gave him her leftover half of the watermelon and then went to take a bath. Zhou Qingbai ate the melon and washed the clothes his wife had changed out of. At the beginning of their relationship, Lin Qing, he was embarrassed about him washing all her clothes. But now she was unperturbed. It's just her heart melts when she came out and saw him washing her clothes. Lin Qing, he had washed her hair while she was at it. She was in the middle of rubbing her hair dry. Zhou Qingbai soon finished with the clothes and came to help his wife dry her hair. Only the two of them were at home. Eldest didn't come back. The two younger ones went out to catch the loach and rice eel. As for Father Zhou and Mother Zhou, they returned after having the watermelon. Not wanting to be in the way at all. Lin Qing, he let Zhou Qing Bai dry her hair. Don't know if it's because of the environment in the big city like the capital, Lin Qing he skin became a shade light each year ever since she went over there to study. She used to be considered quite fair in the countryside. Now she was even fairer. Zhou Qingbai had just finished his farm work. His whole body was like he was painted with a layer of paint. Compared with his wife, it was a stark contrast. On the contrary, Lin Qing, he particularly enjoyed the service of her own man, and said, if you keep getting tanned like this, to the someone unfamiliar, they would think you're from Africa. It will turn whiter again in winter. Zhou Qingbai replied. He didn't mind this at first. He thought it was normal for a man to be darker. However, he wasn't stupid. Although his wife didn't dislike him at all, the man didn't want to look unworthy of his wife. So he cared now. But it can't be helped in the current situation. He had to wait for winter to regain a lighter tone Lin Qing, he let him rub her hair into a half-dry state. Then she closed the door and pulled him back into the room. What they'll do back in the room needn't be said. Her Ching Bai's refreshing smell of his recently washed body kept seducing her when he dried her hair. She missed him too. After a round of business, she went to sleep with him. Er Hua and San Hua came back and found that their parents' room door was closed. They knew they were sleeping. The two of them poured the loach they had caught into a basin. Then they went to wash up and washed the clothes by themselves. Afterward, they went back to the room to turn on the light and study after a while, they blew the lamp and went to bed. Both brothers were quite self-disciplined. In the early morning, Zhou Qingbai went to collect Lin Qinghe's reservation. Lin Qing, he didn't get up. She was very tired after a few days of traveling. Zhou Qingbai brought the things back and put them in the kitchen. Knowing that his wife couldn't clean up the pig's stomach and intestine, he handled it first. Then he went back to continuing to hug his wife to sleep. Not at all bothered with the heat. Despite being tired, Lin Qing, he woke up early in the morning, about 4 o'clock. They, the men, set off around 4.30 a.m. Lin Qing, he lighted the lamp and started cooking. In addition to the cornmeal mantu, she also fried two dishes fried diced pork belly and cucumber and scrambled eggs with tomatoes. There was a shrimp soup too. Zhou Qingbai slept a while longer and then got up. Father Zhou came over at this time. The father and son had a hearty breakfast and set off. Go back and sleep again. Before heading out, 
Zhou Qingbai rubbed his wife's hand and said. And, I'll make something good for you and deliver it at noon, Lin Qing, he replied. Okay. Zhou Qingbai nodded. Then the father and son departed. Mother Zhou headed out after five o'clock. The two boys woke up early. Erwa remarked, my eldest brother is really getting lazy now. He's not coming back during summer vacation. Mother, are there so many fun and delicious foods over there? From I see, my eldest brother doesn't want to come home anymore. Sanwa said. Compared with this side, that side is indeed better. Lin Qing, he answered honestly. In the end, the capital was the capital. Even at this moment, it was developing very well. Changes happen day by day. If you two work hard, you can also go to university there in the future. I had found time at school to write revision questions for you. You two get a set each. This summer vacation, you two better do it properly. Lin Qing, he stated. Mother's question. Erwa wrinkled his face. The question from their mother was really difficult. Lin Qing, he said in a huff, others want it yet can't have it. That's right. Sanwa nodded, let's get Yang Yang and Wu and I to join in. Their foundation isn't solid enough. This question is too difficult for them to do. Just do your own parts. Lin Qing, he said. The two brothers first studied for more than an hour before going out to help out where their father was. As for Lin Qing, he, she started to clean up the backyard. After she finished cleaning, she grabbed a book and read it. When she was in High City, she bought a good few books. Chapter 268 Rat Poop, Good Grades, Didn't Come Out of the Blue She finally and carefully studied. During this period, Mother Zhou came back. When she came back to drink water and saw that she, LQH, was studying in the yard, she didn't disturb her. Once she reached the sun-drying yard, she said to her old friends, Sanwa's mother is really giving it her all. She's in the middle of studying at home now. Whether she's at school or at home, she won't slack off. Then her old friends praised in response. She has lost a lot of weight when she got back this time. Her jaw is sharp. Mother Zhou continued on. There are so many chickens at your home. You have to nourish Dawa's mother. An old lady said. It is time to give supplements. Speaking of this, Ching Bai's mother, you're so fortunate. In the surrounding neighborhood, who doesn't envy Ching Bai's mother now? Before it was the son who was astounding, now it's the daughter-in-law. Another old lady remarked. Although there had been other college students who have passed the entrance examination in the past two years, it was still very few. What's more, none of them got admitted to the university in the capital. Must say, this old seventh was really prospering. The old seventh was Father Zhou. Among this generation in Zhou Jia village, Father Zhou ranked seventh. Mother Zhou laughed and chattered with them. They could talk about Lin Qing, he being studious, for a day. Lin Qing, he's mind had nothing else, just memorizing sentences, familiarizing with the grammar, and then writing it down from memory. Even on the train, she was like this. When it was 10.30, it was almost time to cook. Only then, Lin Qing, he started to work. Stir-fried pork intestine with pickled vegetable bits. One can never get tired of this common dish. The pork belly was cut into finger width. It was eaten as a cold salad. Extremely delectable. Another was braised pork. She bought a lot of pork. It can't last in this kind of weather, so she just made a large portion. The rest had been sprinkled with salt. Mother Zhou went home to eat. As for others, Lin Qing, he sent it over when it was ready. Zhou Qing Bai, Father Zhou, and the two boys were exhausted. Lin Qing, he directed at Father Zhou, hurry up and eat, Father. Scoop more mung bean soup later. I had let it cool. Okay. Father Zhou was already at that age. Fortunately, his body was healthy. And he often took breaks too. That's why he can keep on going. 
Lin Qing, he urged them to lie down under the tree after finish eating and said, wait for the horn to sound before going back. With this weather, it won't rain. The sky was cloudless. Clearly, it was bright and sunny. Lin Qing, he didn't stay long. She returned first after packing away the dishes. She soaked some mung beans to cook in the evening as supper. How could anyone stand such weather? When returning home in the evening, Zhou Qingbai was holding a plump rabbit. It was caught in the wheat field. Obviously, it'll be fat. Of course, the rabbit will be braised during the summer harvest, Mother Zhou got Zhou Qingbai to kill a chicken to nourish Lin Qingyi's body. Lin Qing, he didn't hold back. Still, the whole family ate it together. Once the summer harvest was over, everyone sighed in relief. Lin Qing, he didn't continue her grain resale anymore. She had no desire for that bit of money made by reselling grains. Not to mention the hard work, it was still risky, even if the situation improved a lot. The goods brought back from High City made more than this. So she just didn't want to anymore. Lin Qing, he was feeling lazy in this hot weather. However, it was truly not easy for farmers, especially people in this era. After the summer harvest, it didn't mean that they can be idle. After the grain was harvested, it was time to cultivate the land and plant the grain for the next season. Zhou Qingbai came back that evening. The food at home was very simple, but also very refreshing and delicious. A small cabbage and salted eggs were served with white congee. It was simple, but the taste was top-notch. No need to make something complicated in the summer. The heat withered away one's appetite. In the evening, Lin Qing, he, and Zhou Qing Bai went out for a swim. Lin Qing, he sat on the rock and soaked her feet. Zhou Qing Bai went into the water by himself. He liked swimming very much and would come to swim every three days or so. After swimming for more than half an hour, Lin Qing, he urged Zhou Qing Bai to go home. Zhou Qing Bai complyingly came up. Because there was no one, he had changed a pair of underwear, so he won't feel wet and uncomfortable. And he can just head home and go to sleep. Lin Qing, he watched him without blinking. Zhou Qingbai noticed it when he looked up. The corners of his mouth raised slightly. The gaze toward his wife was a bit deep. Lin Qing, he went. She deciphered from her Qingbai's eyes, wait till we get home later. I'll let you have a good look. The couple was on their way home. They noticed someone sneaking in the middle of the night and heading towards the back mountain. Isn't that old fourth ma? Lin Qing, he uttered in puzzlement, what is he up to this late? Looking for Wang Ling. Zhou Qingbai simply answered without guessing. Only then, Lin Qing, he recalled that Wang Ling was with old fourth ma at the beginning when they got found out by old third ma. Later, she and Zhou he ended up getting criticized. Never thought these two would be still in contact. Lin Qing, he responded. Zhou Qingbai didn't say anything. Wang Ling's reputation was terrible now. What he didn't tell his wife was that Wang Ling even came to him once and asked him if he was lonely and that he could go to her place at night to play. She won't charge him money. It went without saying, Zhou Qingbai ignored it. He was really disgusted. It was better to not tell his wife about this kind of thing to prevent her from being mad for nothing. When the couple got home, a round of black pressing on white. Then they fell asleep. The next day, Lin Qing, he came over to third sister-in-law's place. While she was at it, she paid attention to Wang Ling's side. Though it was said to be pay attention, it was actually a test. She wasn't home. And her Qing Bai was a manly guy. He was tall and got a handsome face. Although he was tanned, he did appear more masculine and handsome. There was no doubt that Lin Qing, he believes in Zhou Qing Bai. But it did not mean that she believes in Wang Ling third sister-in-law left and said, you still have to worry about this. Fourth brother isn't blind. How can he possibly look at her? Wang Ling, that rat poop was currently staying in the back mountain because the gang of four had fallen and no one will criticize her again. 
she also became more unscrupulous. Some improper to the core men had been tempted away by her. You don't know, old fourth ma often go over. His wife frequently quarrels with him about this matter. There are also others from other villages. There is foul air on the back mountain. I have never seen such a morally corrupt person. It only exists now. If it was before, see if she won't get criticized to death. Third sister-in-law said with disgust. She really didn't lure my Ching Bai? Lin Ching, he asked. Don't worry. We are all watching. Fourth brother, treat you like the apple of his eyes. Who in the village doesn't know that he specially made a trip to see you during the previous heavy rain? Third sister-in-law laughed. Lin Ching, he was relieved after hearing this. Chapter 269 Setting up a stall, believing in her own man, was one thing. She still had to pay attention to defending her marriage on the other hand. After hearing from third sister-in-law, Lin Qing he dropped the matter. Instead, she chatted with third sister-in-law about Wu Ni's results. With these grades, she has to work harder to enter the county's junior high. She got to take advantage of this summer vacation and try to memorize more poems and songs and rewrite from memory. I will give them two test papers in a few days and have a go, Lin Qing, he said. We have troubled you. Third sister-in-law responded at once. It's not much trouble. However, studying does exhaust the children's brain. Third sister-in-law, you and eldest sister-in-law shouldn't be prudent. It doesn't cost much. The current conditions are better than before. Let them eat two eggs a day as a supplement. Lin Qing, he persuaded. This was why she didn't want their eggs. They basically don't buy meat much. The only meaty thing in the family was these eggs. There were times, they had some fish, shrimp, loach, eel, and so on. Obviously, the eggs were the most. She felt it wasn't right to take their eggs. She told third sister-in-law to let eldest sister-in-law know when she comes back. Then Lin Qing, he will go home. As soon as she came out of the entrance of old Zhou's house, Lu and I followed. As the girl gets older, she became more and more troublesome. It was true that she was smart, but obviously too smart. Smart people know how to make themselves likable. However, overly smart ones will only increase people's dislike. Fourth aunt, wait for me, called out Lu and I as she followed. Lin Qing, he glanced at her, Lu and I, what's the matter? Fourth aunt, are you going to stay in the capital in the future and won't come back? Lu and I asked outright. Lin Qing, he smiled, how is this possible? My hometown will always be my home. This is our route. Even if we go out and develop in the future, people can't forget their roots. Lu and I, don't you agree? Lu and I responded, fourth aunt, if you stay in the capital in the future, can I go over? I can do chores for you. I can clean up everything that needs to clean up at home. I can also do laundry and cooking. Lin Qing, he understood then. See, she was right. This girl was too clever. Not a shadow in sight. You can just help your mother with chores at home. Lin Qing, he finished and turned around to return home. Lu and I watched her back and frowned, she's having a good life and doesn't even promote her niece. So cruel. No wonder she can't give birth to a daughter in this life. Lu and I, what are you saying? Wu and I glared. Lu and I was startled. She turned to look at her and said disgruntedly, don't you know that people can scare people to death? No sound when walking at all. Saying bad things about fourth aunt and still dare to quibble when I heard it? Wu and I responded. Nonsense. Fourth aunt is so nice, how could I possibly say bad things about fourth aunt? Lu and I returned with a harumph and then turned to leave. Wu and I was so vexed that she went back in and tattled to her mother. Third sister-in-law frowned and said, don't worry about her. Your fourth aunt isn't someone a little girl like her can scheme. After her response, she wanted to sigh. Really, this second branch. Don't they know how their second girl turn out? Everyone took it all in. 
why didn't that couple see it? Lin Qing, he didn't care about this. Like third sister-in-law said, would she fall into a scheme by a little girl like Lu and I? In fact, if she was a good one, she can bring her over to help out when she opens a shop or something in the capital. It won't be a matter to pay a salary. However, with Luni's behavior, who would dare to bring her? Just those eyes. When it wandered around, it showed unruliness. This made people feel uneasy at sight. Lin Qing, he threw it to the back of her mind. When she got home, she continued to read her book and silently jot down her notes. Now that the summer harvest was over, Zhou Qing Bai was the only one who worked in the field. Father Zhou had breakfast early in the morning and herded the ducks out. As for Mother Zhou, she had gone over and chat with other old ladies at the moment. Halfway through studying, Lin Qing, he realized that it was a bit muggy. Mother Zhou came back a short while later. Lin Qing, he asked, Mother, judging by the weather, do you think it's going to rain? I feel like it's going to rain. Mother Zhou answered. The weather was too sultry. Lin Qing, he cooked a simple lunch because Zhou Qing Bai was still working. So he had mantu with congee and soup. There were some side dishes. After lunchtime, Lin Qing, he hopped on her bicycle and came to the city. As for Er Hua and San Hua, they had to continue attending their supplementary classes at school. Since the recovery of the college entrance examination, both the community's elementary school and the community's junior high school had begun a new chapter. They were working hard to train students. Of course, these summer supplementary lessons cost nothing. There weren't many people who took up these lessons. A requirement was top grades. Both Er Hua and San Hua participated. Lin Qing, he came over and dropped by Shen Yu's place. Shen Yu was very happy to see her coming, Sister, what are you going to buy today? Weigh out some dried shrimp skins, red dates, and dried longans for me. Lin Qing, he smiled. There were a lot of things she wanted to buy. Like milk powder. She bought a pack of them. It'll be kept for her and Zhou Qing Bai to drink at night for health maintenance. Also, two large watermelons. After she finished shopping, she put the packed bag aside. Lin Qing, he said in a low voice, How are they selling? Pretty well. In response to this, Xin Yu smiled and pulled Lin Qing he outside to speak, There are still some left. I estimate it will be sold out in a while. In fact, when Lin Qing he came here, she knew that business wasn't bad at the sight of Xin Yu's upbeat face. Although those clothes styles seemed a bit simpler in Lin Qing he's eyes, the styles were really good in this county. The female fellows absolutely couldn't take a step when they saw it. But the current environment was no longer what it used to be. This year, Lin Qing he saw in High City that some people even started to wear skirts that hadn't been seen for a long time. So, if this kind of clothes were brought over here to sell, the business will definitely be great. Lin Qing, he earned almost 7 yuan for each piece of clothing or men's belts. Xin Yu and her colleagues increased the price by 2 or 3 yuan. From High City to the County City, 10 yuan's price difference wasn't too expensive. If they went to High City instead? However, clothes made a small profit. Products like electric fans and watches made the biggest earning. But so far, it was really hard to source them. When the circumstance reaches another stage next year, she will take Zhou Qing Bai to the capital and let him set up a street stall. Chapter 270 High school entrance exam after agreeing to Xin Yu's request to bring some back next time, Lin Qing, he came over to Zhou Xiaomei's place. She had bought two watermelons. One was given to Zhou Xiaomei. Fourth sister-in-law, when did you come back? Zhou Xiaomei was very surprised. She hadn't gone to work since this month and nurtured her pregnancy at home. Now her belly was almost seven months old, which wasn't small at all. I came back during the summer harvest rush. At that time, there was a tractor going back to the neighboring village. I hurriedly hopped on and didn't have time to talk to you. Lin Qing, he smiled. 
Fourth and, our family also has a big watermelon. Take both of them back for second brother and the others to eat. Su Ching said. He was in elementary school. He was extraordinarily smart and sensible. Also, his relationship with his two cousins, Er Hua and San Hua, was close. He still remembered the days when he was a little in his hometown. Delin just bought one back today. It's in the kitchen. Hasn't been cut yet. Zhou Xiaomei smiled. Then she went in and cut the watermelon to entertain her fourth sister-in-law. Don't busy yourself. I'll do it. Lin Qing, he looked at her large belly. She really didn't dare to sit and let her entertain. So she went in and cut the watermelon herself. The watermelon is cold, eat less. Lin Qing, he said to her. Zhou Xiaomei said, fourth sister-in-law, I lost my job. If you lose it, then lose it. 30 yuan a month isn't a lot. Lin Qing, he waved her hand and said indifferently. She looked at Su Qing and said, come and eat the watermelon. Eat this. The one aunt brought can be kept for your father to eat later. Su Qing picked up the watermelon and ate it. Fourth sister-in-law, did you get rich? Zhou Xiaomei also grabbed a piece to eat and asked her. 30 yuan a month. That was really a lot. What getting rich? 30 yuan a month truly isn't much. If you listen to me, then properly deliver the baby. You don't have to worry about everything else. When the time comes, your fourth sister-in-law will take you flying. You only need to count the money. Don't have to worry about it, Lin Qing, he replied. Zhou Xiaomei laughed when she heard it, fourth sister-in-law, you're getting better at making me happy. As long as you are happy. When you are free, take the kids out for a walk more. Don't stay at home. It's stuffy. Lin Qing, he suggested. Then she asked, next time, do you want me to bring you an electric fan? There was electricity in the city, but Zhou Xiaomei didn't have any appliances yet. It's too expensive. Not easy to buy at all. Also, it requires a lot of connections. Zhou Xiaomei shook her head. It's indeed pretty expensive. Lin Qing, he replied. At this time, the electrical appliances were really expensive. She heard that a refrigerator cost several thousand yuan. What's more, how much were the houses now? In the future, you'll settle down in the capital. I have plans to go over and take refuge with you. I will hold all the money I currently have, Zhou Xiaomei said. She also understood that it was more secure to carry more money when she is away from home. Lin Qing, he nodded. At this time, Su De Lin was at work, Lin Qing, he didn't stay much longer. She left a watermelon behind. However, Zhou Xiaomei brought it out, there are so many people at home. Fourth sister-in-law, take it back home to eat. It's not like we don't have any here. Fourth aunt, take it back and feed it to my second brother and the others. This year, second brother will be in the first year of high school. Tell second brother to come over to live with me and sleep with me. Su Qing said. Okay. Lin Qing, he smiled and cycled back. She didn't even notice that her heir Hua was going to enter the first year of high school this year and sold all the electric fans she brought. If not, how great it would be to keep one at Xiaomei's place. The small bungalows in the city were fine, but they were too stuffy. They can't be compared to the countryside's openness. Next time, she'll bring one back. Lin Qing, he took two watermelons. She didn't go back to the village straight away. She made a detour and delivered one to her third brother. Both her brother and her sister-in-law went to the field. Only two girls were at home. Lin Qing, he dropped off the watermelon and then returned. When Lin Qing, he returned home, Wu and I and Zhou Yang were both studying in the yard. Lin Qing, he had put away everything and then came to check them. She explained two questions and gave three more questions for them to do. 
Before doing these three questions, she got the cousins to write out the English words that Lin Qing he told them to memorize after class yesterday. She let them correct themselves. Wu and I made two mistakes, while one error for Zhou Yang. Lin Qing he only left five words based on their abilities. There were also the previous memorizations that had to be rewritten. There were still mistakes. Write the incorrect ones ten times. I will check it tomorrow. Let's continue to do the questions now. Lin Qing, he said. The siblings worked on the problems. The questions from their fourth aunt weren't easy. The two brothers and sisters did their own one and mulled on it separately. Soon Erwa and Sanwa returned. Both of them went to supplementary classes. While Wu and I and Zhou Yang didn't. Erwa and Sanwa huddled over and looked at the questions. Sanwa hadn't calculated it yet, but he did a lot of mathematical Olympiad problems. He remarked, these aren't difficult. Sister, you can solve it with the method you used for this question. He pulled out the question from Wu Ni's previous homework. It's difficult. Wu and I grumbled. She didn't understand the connection between the two questions. It's all in the same model. Not difficult. Sanwa said. Have you memorized the words? Erwa asked. Sanwa stuck out his tongue and then went to recite his own English words. Lin Qing, he personally taught her fluent spoken language, which made Wu and I and Zhou Yang envious. Erwa also started to work on his own homework. This one was eager to enter the university in the capital. That's why he had self-initiative and worked very hard in his studies. Currently, he was first in his grade in the community's junior high. What's more, he was currently taking extra classes. The community's teacher was actually holding private lessons and let him preview high school knowledge in advance. It wasn't that he had nothing to do with the school after passing the entrance exam and the school will do nothing. In the future, if Erwa comes out on top over other students at the county high school, then the community's junior high school will also become famous. It will be especially prestigious. After all, he graduated from the community's junior high. Your high school entrance examination results are coming out soon? Lin Qing, he asked. It should around these days. Erwa nodded. Lin Qing, he didn't continue to ask. While Zhou Yang couldn't help but say, how did you do in the exam? I have done everything I can. Nothing was left out. I just don't know if it's right. Erwa shook his head. Zhou Yang couldn't help but admire him. There was nothing he couldn't do. This was so cool. Wu and I also appeared envious. They all studied at the community's junior high school. They all knew how good Erwa was. You guys, work hard. It will be your turn next year, said Erwa. N. Zhou Yang and Wu and I both nodded. They only want to pass the exam and go to the city to study. They dare not think of any ranking. Chapter 271 A Blessed Lif E is behind Erwa's result had yet to arrive. But a heavy rain did come knocking. After seven days of heavy rain, it stopped. Erwa's results also came out. The county's first place. Math scores and English scores had pulled him further ahead from the county's second place. A difference of 50 points. Both the county's high school's community and their community's junior high school awarded a scholarship. Lin Qing, he confiscated half of this scholarship. She left the remaining half for Erwa to manage by himself. Sanwa was so excited, Erwa, you can buy me a football. The old football was worn out to a bad state and couldn't be played anymore. He desperately wanted a new football, so he was saving money to buy it. He had pocket money. For example, before his mother went to college, she gave him three yuan pocket money. He saved it all. Sometimes when he went to pick up some rags and exchange it for a bit. The toothpaste tube can also be exchanged for money. Still, he hadn't accumulated much. No money. I want to buy steady materials. 
I also want to buy a basketball over there. Erwa responded. You have so much here. I don't want a lot. Just sponsor me 10 yuans. Sanwa stuck on him. In the end, Erwa reluctantly gave him 5 yuan. Sanwa took what he saved and went to find his mother. Lin Qing, he accepted the money, and agreed, I will buy it for you next time. Sanwa was satisfied. Although Lin Qing, he wasn't stern with her son on money matters, she wasn't very generous either. In many cases, they were asked to use their own brains to find ways to make money. As long as they didn't use crooked roots, she generally didn't intervene. For boys, they have to be roughly raised. In the eyes of the people in the village, she was simply spoiling the children. As soon as this day flipped over, Erwa began his class in advance. The high school was now paying close attention. It was only August 15 when Erwa had to attend school. Lin Qing, he brought him over to stay at Zhou Xiaomei's place. On the way, she got him a change of clothes and toiletries next year, mother will bring you an electric fan back. Lin Qing, he said. No need. Bear a bit and it'll be over. It's just two years. There is no need to spend that money. Erwa didn't mind. Of the three sons, this kid looked the most like her and was also the most clever one. Lin Qing, he smiled. She didn't bicker with him about this. After coming to Zhou Xiaomei's place to drop the things, she took Erwa out for a stroll. Erwa was no stranger to the county city. Although he didn't come very often, he did visit his eldest brother when he was studying here. Zhou Xiaomei's house wasn't very far from here. It will take about 15 minutes to walk, so she led her Washington walk. This time she ate at Zhou Xiaomei's place. Su De Lin's cooking was delicious. De Wai used to praise it all the time. The living expenses given were sufficient. Aunt, Er Wa. The mother and son were strolling around when a surprised shout came from behind them. Lin Qing, he and Er Wa turned around and saw an acquaintance. Well, wasn't this Han Su Jia? It can be regarded that Lin Qing, he had completely let go of her vigilance against Han Su Jia. After all, her eldest son was in university and will join the army in the future. So he will not take the same path as his previous life. No worries at all. Su Jia. Lin Qing, he was delighted to see the male lead, Han Su Jia. Brother Su Jia. Er Hua also cried out. Aunt, Er Hua, how come you're here? Han Su Jia walked up and said with a smile. Tomorrow, he will start school. So we come over to get familiar first? Lin Qing, he responded with a smile. I haven't thought about that. This year, Er Hua is going to be in the first year of high school. Han Su Jia realized right then. You're free to come back this year? Lin Qing, he said. I come back every year. Did Zhou Kai come back this year? Han Su Jia asked. Lin Qing, he said, he didn't come back. He's exploring the capital. He did mention to me about wanting to find you in Shenyang. As the male lead, he was a proper top student. He was directly admitted to the best police academy in Shenyang. Still, it was obvious that Han Su Jia was family oriented. In the future, he will also come back to his hometown. On the normal course of action, he'll graduate in 1981 and earn a lot of credit during the crackdown in 1983. After that, he'll advance and become a figure in the municipal city. Though it was just a municipal city, the level still wasn't low at all. What's more, it was an achievement he achieved when he was 30 years old. After 30 years old, he became even more prosperous and became a provincial level figure. Lin Qing, he looked at the young man in front of her. She was overwhelmed with emotion and said, Zhou Kai will join the army in the future. While you are in this profession too. You two are really good brothers. The male lead was righteous. They can interact with more. A 1.8M fellow was just as excellent as her eldest son. However, Lin Qing, he was afraid of the heroine, who hadn't appeared yet. 
like particularly scared because she was the femme fatale who was swaying between her third boy and the male lead. So she didn't want to have too close contacts. It'll be great if there was incense left to pray with. Han Su Jia laughed and said, when he comes out of the army, I will compare notes with him. Because there was still something to do, they chatted a little longer and then he went back. Lin Qing, he let him be. After taking air while around the school and surrounding places, she came to the mall to buy a football for San Hua. In addition to that, she bought two packs of candy and gave one pack to Air Hua. She told him to take it back to share with his little cousins. She left the other pack for San Hua. Study hard every day to climb up. Mother will go back now. Lin Qing, he waved and said. Mother, mind your steps. Erwa waved back and then went back into his aunt's house. Lin Qing, he came home, gave the football to San Hua, and said, I'll leave the candy at home. Just get it yourself. I know. San Hua answered. He was already running out with the football. Mother Zhou said, now that he has this ball, I'm afraid he won't be home all day long. They're like that once they grow up. We as mothers, just need to raise them. We don't need to worry for a lifetime. Let them walk the rest of the road by themselves. When they need us, they will naturally come to us for ideas. Lin Qing, he responded. Although she was sentimental about the few troublesome turnip heads had become so big in a blink of an eye, it was life. Sometimes, when being emotional, she recalled the beautiful moments. Mother Zhou smiled and said, Your father and I used to worry a lot. Worried that I'll go through all the money? And that the few boys won't be able to marry a wife in the future? Lin Qing, he asked. That's right. I was worried about this at that time. Both your father and I were thinking of making more money to save while we are mobile. Mother Zhou grinned. Back then, I estimated that the college entrance examination would be resumed. However, I was worried that no one would believe it, so I didn't say anything. Lin Qing, he explained. With the situation back then, no one would believe it. Mother Zhou agreed. In the future, the development will get better and better. It won't be the same as before. Mother, you and father must take good care of your health. You'll enjoy a blessed life later. Lin Qing, he said. Chapter 272 that generation Mother Zhou's expression was cheery. In the middle of the night, she told Father Zhou about this. From Fourth's wife's meaning, I think she'll bring us over to the capital in the future. Mother Zhou whispered. Her voice was immersed in joy. Father Zhou was silent for a moment when he heard these words, What are we going to do in the capital? Us two can just stay here at home. If they go out in the future, we will watch the house. That's the capital. Don't you want to go there and take a look? There are the Heavenly Palace Gate and the Plaza. Mother Zhou uttered. Father Zhou wanted to. How could he not? Such places are simply symbols of ordinary people like them. Everything costs money when going everywhere outside. It won't be stable when they just move over. We'll stay at home. Once they develop well in the future, We'll see if we go out and see then. Father Zhou stated. Fourth's wife will definitely stay at the school in the future. Don't know if she can arrange a gatekeeper job for Qing Bai. Like this, the couple can also be together. Mother Zhou pondered. You can really think. Father Zhou disgruntedly responded. What? You find it embarrassing? Mother Zhou knew what he meant when she heard this and outright responded. A job was rare at this time. There was nothing to feel ashamed about. But from the old man's reaction it was clearly disgust. It's not that it's shameful to guard the gate. Dewa and his mother are both studying in school and you want Qing Bai to guard the gate? Father Zhou said. What about it? Then do you want Qing Bai to sit and eat idle meals? Ching Bai can't stand that. Mother Zhou knew her youngest son. Don't worry about that. They must have their own plans. 
Let's not make trouble for them and just stay at home. Father Zhou urged. Lin Qing, He, and Zhou Qing Bai were also sleeping at their end. Zhou Qing Bai wasn't behaving. However, he restrained by Lin Qing, He, and obediently went to sleep. No doing anything. The next morning, only Mother Zhou and Lin Qing, He was left at home. Mother Zhou came over and brought up this matter. De Wa's mother. If you go to the capital in the future, Qing Bai won't have anything to do. Don't know if it's possible to let him guard the gate then? Does the school want someone like him? Mother Zhou asked. Lin Qing, he paused a moment. Then she was dumbfounded. Did her mother-in-law want her Qing Bai to go be a security guard at Bei University? De Wa's mother, what do you think? Mother Zhou continued on. She contemplated all night last night. She thought it was great and dismissed the old man's words. Her youngest son got the skills and can protect the school. It won't hurt to let her old son guard the gate. Mother, you are willing. But I can't bear to let my Qing Bai guard the gate. Lin Qing, he laughed and answered. But. But if he doesn't do this, then what can he do? Jobs in the capital are hard to find, no? Mother Zhou didn't expect her to disagree. Mother, you can reassure. I have discussed it with Qing Bai. We have our plans. When we settle down there, we will pick you and father up. Don't worry about this. Lin Qing, he comforted. The elderly were thinking the best for the couple, so it was understandable. When she heard this, Mother Zhou nodded and said, All right then. Mother won't go on. As long as you know what you are doing. Lin Qing, he continued studying. Time flew by and it was the day when Lin Qing, he got to depart. Zhou Qing Bai escorted her to the county city. The couple said goodbye to each other. Graduation is next year. It'll be soon. Lin Qing, he said. N. Once you're there, don't exhaust yourself. Zhou Qingbai looked at her as he spoke. I know. Same for you at home. Take care of your own body. You aren't allowed to reduce the amount of milk ordered every day. You have to drink it all, understood? Lin Qing, he instructed. The family currently ordered four bottles of milk every day. It was distributed within the whole family. That way, nutrition intake increased. N. Zhou Qingbai acknowledged. Don't know when, but he had begun to consciously take care of his body. Before, he basically didn't care about these. Now, he wanted a healthy body to accompany her and continue to protect her. He didn't voice these words out. He also won't say these words out loud. He'll just silently take action. Lin Qing, he hopped on the bus. Zhou Qingbai stood for a long time. Afterward, he cycled over to Zhou Xiaomei's place. He brought Zhou Xiaomei a few jeans of soybeans, as well as rations, for the Erhua. He left 5 yuan pocket money for Erhua. Then Zhou Qingbai went home. There was nothing to say to the sons. Only need to raise them up. The only one that was actually placed in his heart was his wife. Lin Qing, he didn't have strong feelings about parting. She read books all the way back. When she got off the train, she saw her eldest son. I knew mother will return on this train. Zhou Kai grinned and took the baggage from his mother. Lin Qing, he smiled and said, How long have you been waiting here? Not long. Zhou Kai said, Mother, are you hungry? We'll have a meal first before going back. Okay. Lin Qing he followed him and mentioned Han Xujia, he's over in Shenyang now. Er Hua and I bumped into him. He said when you're free, go find him. I'll see if can find some spare time this winter vacation and find him. Zhou Kai replied. He'll go back home during the winter vacation. Lin Qing, he said, your grandparents miss you. Will you go back this year? Not going back. I want to go with my classmate to his brother's camp to learn more. Zhou Kai frowned. Lin Qing, he let him do as he liked. 
As long as he didn't go beyond the standard, he can go wild. After eating, Zhou Kai reached out his hand for money to pay the bill. Lin Qing, he gave him 20 yuan, be more frugal. It's not easy for your father to make some money. I know. Zhou Kai nodded, mother, it's not difficult for you to make money. Stinky brat. Lin Qing, he scolded in amusement. The boy believed that she hadn't been reselling. There was no evidence, so she didn't bother with him. Once Lin Qing, he reached the campus, Wang Li took her to the bathhouse to take a shower. I came back yesterday. I'm surprised that you came back a little bit later than me. Still, you're back exactly on time. Wang Li said. Lin Qing, he was still a little uncomfortable with the bathhouse. However, it was refreshing to wash up. She said, whether it's coming early or coming late, it's the same. This year, there are a lot of new students. It is quite a number. Wang Li nodded and talked about redress while taking a bath. My man did an act of kindness before. A municipal city leader was sent to our place for reform. My man took care of him. At this moment, redress is happening. Wang Li said. Lin Qing, he knew that the redress had already begun, and said, a good man will get rewarded and he will be declared innocent in the end if he was wronged. Wang Li whispered, what's the use of innocence? His family had been broken up. I heard that his wife divorced and took the child back then. Don't know whether she had remarried. Lin Qing, he said, it's better than continuing to suffer. As for the rest, she didn't know what to say. She hadn't experienced it, so she was ineligible to make comments. After all, that generation was really suffering. Chapter 273 Early graduation, campus life, was routine and stressful. No wonder it was a prestigious school. The learning atmosphere was different. If one didn't work hard here, they won't be able to blend into this atmosphere. Lin Qing, he wasn't idle at all. Because of her excellent grades, her tutor told her to give lectures as one English teacher was occupied these days. Although Lin Qing, he was taken by surprise, she took up the job. This was a good opportunity for her to practice. How could she miss it? So she went to the podium and started this class. Her tutor just stood at the back and observed. If it were another person, there might be some pressure. But for Lin Qing, he, there was none. What need to say, will be explained. If one didn't understand, they bring it up. Lin Qing, he would briefly analyze it one by one. She also extended some other knowledge. She suggested which books to read about grammar and phrasing because class time was limited and told them to go to the library to find them. After this class, Lin Qing, he was called to the office by her tutor. Will you substitute some English lessons for other classes? Her tutor, smilingly said. All right. Lin Qing, he nodded. So starting from this day, Lin Qing, he had to occasionally substitute lessons. It can't be helped, the English teacher was a middle-aged woman. She was 35 years old this year and after being infertile for many years, she was finally pregnant. How could she not treasure this? And because of the previous deportation, her body had also suffered a lot. Now this child was extremely precious. Like this, Lin Qing he substituted these classes. However, for the time being, she wasn't officially appointed as a teacher, so she wasn't paid. It was clear the school was testing her. Lin Qing, he felt that she was very likely to finish school earlier than she expected. Wang Li was extremely envious. Still, she accepted it very quickly. Are you sure you don't want to continue on to postgraduate courses or something? This suggestion was naturally extremely normal. After all, with such good grades, many will choose to continue studying. Lin Qing, he had no plans to. She was reading. Without raising her head, she responded, I can't wait to get a job and get accommodation to bring my man and children over. You want me to continue studying? It's a pity, Wang Li honestly remarked. It was indeed a pity not to continue. Even her tutor had the same thought. 
It was still that phrase. A sufficient degree was enough. Lin Qing, he really didn't have that high ambition. The life she imagined was being with her family's Qing Bai and accumulate a few more houses. The children would get one each, while the two of them would keep the rest for themselves. Later, if they lack money, they would sell one. Then they can enjoy life. The rest will be for collecting rent. Her ambitions only amount to this. Postgraduate or postdoctoral was really out of her plan. Your man is really blessed. Wang Li smiled, seeing that she unmoved by a potential career. Your man is also blessed, Lin Qing, he returned with a grin. Seeing that there was no one else in the dormitory, Wang Li whispered, I went back this summer and told my man about it. He agreed on moving to the municipal city in the future. Of course, he agrees. A wife like you, how can he not guard? Lin Qing, he said. Wang Li smiled and said, I told him about doing business in the future. He didn't agree. He's worried about embarrassing me. Speaking of this, Lin Qing he smiled even more, my mother-in-law wants my man to come over to the school to watch the gate. There's this matter? Wang Li chuckled out, then Uncle Wang got competitions. Not going to snatch the old man's rice bowl. Lin Qing, he waved her hand, and then got back to the subject, what's your man's thought? There are no more restrictions. It can't do, the mind got to advance. Next time you go back, tell him that my man had retired from the army and he's more rigid than he is. He plans to come with me to open a shop and become a self-employed person. When will he come? When the time comes, I will get him to come and learn something. Wang Li said after hearing this. I don't know. If the school is willing to let me graduate early this year, then I will bring him here early next year. Lin Qing, he said. I don't think teacher Ma Ying's pregnancy is going smooth. Afraid she will have to rest more. Now the month is still small. But when the month gets bigger, she basically can't get tired. Wang Li said. Nowadays, teachers were scarce. English teachers were even more so. They had to take on a lot of classes and had to stand for so long in one go. Pregnant people tend to get tired easily. How can they stand it? Wang Li was right. Teacher Ma Ying asked for leave in the middle of the semester. Her man came to request a leave. She started to feel uncomfortable last night, but fortunately, it wasn't too urgent. Her husband wouldn't let her come. She had to wait until she gave birth. As a result, the school made an exception to let Lin Qing, he, the temporary substitute, graduate early. Of course, she had to take the exam. Fortunately, Lin Qing, he had finished the revising a long time ago. Although she didn't get full marks on the test, it was very close. Moreover, her grades were also well known. Especially since her reading volume was very large. She can even compile the sentences of many books easily. Her memory was strong. Even if she was to teach those who were formerly on her same level, no one in several classes had any objections. Like this, Lin Qing he graduated half a year earlier and became an English teacher from the college entrance exam's first batch of students that entered Bay University. Zhou Kai came to see his mother after finding out. He held deep admiration. Mother, if you are five or ten years younger than you are, I will have to chase you. Zhou Kai said. You go and tell your father this. Lin Qing, he smirked. Zhou Kai hurriedly asked, Mother, when will you get allocated a place? Isn't it time to bring my father and the rest over? The house is still being arranged. Your father will come next year. Let's discuss it when everything has settled here. That way, he won't be running around once he gets here. Lin Qing, he said. Tisk, mother, you're still thinking of my father. My two brothers are also at home. Zhou Kai shook his head and said. Sooner or later, they will come together. Lin Qing, he waved her hand. Her man was just one step ahead. As for the sons, they can wait a bit. What's the rush? 
Lin Qing, he received the two eggs that were brought over by her son and walked to the dormitory while eating them. She was currently still living in the dormitory. The accommodation will be arranged. But for now, there was none available. Once there was, they'll arrange one for her. Lin Qing, he thought the accommodation would take some time. Unexpectedly, when she came to the library with Wang Li the next day, the old librarian said, has the school not allocated a house for you? Not yet. Housing is currently tight. The school doesn't have it easy. Lin Qing, he answered. I have an apartment. I plan to transfer it to the school. You can bring your family over to live there. The old librarian said. Lin Qing, he was stunned, uncle. I can't really? She could sense that the old librarian was helping her. It's nothing. Your son sends me a boiled egg every day. The old librarian waved his hand. He stopped chatting with Lin Qing He and went to sort out the books. Chapter 274 New home Lin Qing He asked her eldest son about it when he brought the eggs over today. Ah? I sent him eggs. He asked me, so I just told him. Zhou Kai said as he scratched his head, is old grandpa helping out on his own? N. Lin Qing, he nodded. The old librarian was surnamed Wang, which was a very common local surname here in the capital. He and Lin Qing, he can be considered acquaintance because he often helps her to reserve a spot. However, she didn't expect that her son had such a good relationship with him. As soon as he heard that the school hadn't allocated a place, he transferred an apartment under his name to the school. Although he received a sum of money, he had made things convenient for Lin Qing He. The apartment is pretty good. It's more than 50 square meters. Although the building is a bit older, it's still very good. Her tutor came over two days later and told Lin Qing He. Lin Qing He said, I've talked with Uncle Wang. I will go over to check it out with him after school today. All right. Uncle Wang had specially told the school to allocate this place to you. Her tutor smiled. I remember this in my heart. Lin Qing, he nodded. After school, Lin Qing, he brought her eldest son and followed Uncle Wang. The place is good, but there are a lot of people living here. If you are on your own, don't come over yet. Live at school first and set up some things. When your husband comes, move in then. Uncle Wang advised. What is there to worry about? I am here. Zhou Kai said when he heard these words. You aren't home all day. If something happens, can she find you? Uncle Wang bluntly pointed out, this year, many people have returned to the city. I guess that there will be more and more in the future. I am afraid that there is no guarantee in terms of public security. So listening to me is right. It's true. Lin Qing, he nodded in agreement. N. You go and have a look at it first. It's the middle one on the third floor. Uncle Wang gave the keys to the mother and son and said. Uncle, won't you go up? Lin Qing, he asked. Not going. Uncle Wang waved his hand and turned to go back. Before leaving, he reminded them, the next door surname is Zhang. They're a bad bunch. Be careful when you live there in the future. All right. Lin Qing, he nodded in response. After watching him leave, Lin Qing, he and her eldest son went up to the third floor. There were a total of four floors. Have to say that the third floor was well maintained. It was indeed a bit messy, but it was like this in this era. Having a place to stay was already quite good. Lin Qing, he, and Zhou Kai opened the door to see the place. Probably due to no one living here, for a long time, it was empty and accumulated lot of dust inside. Still, having a place to rest was excellent. Mother, this house is considered spacious. My classmate, Wen Wu Liang's house is almost the same. Zhou Kai looked around with great satisfaction. It's pretty good. Lin Qing, he nodded. The location wasn't too far from the school. Once Zhou Qingbai comes, they will come over to eat. 
eldest son can stay at the school. While she lives with Zhou Qingbai here. There was room for two younger ones. As for father Zhou and mother Zhou, they can't be brought over in a short period of time. Have to wait until the market is really open and they can buy a house. So starting from this day, Lin Qing, He, and Zhou Kai had one more job. After class, they came over to clean up the place in the evening and arranged furniture into the place. It wasn't much. Just a few small things each day. Less than a month later, the place looked decent. Your family recently moved in? Old Wang sold this place, an old lady asked with a smile. Aunt, you are? Lin Qing, he looked at her. I live next to you on the left. Just call me, Aunt Ma. The enthusiastic old lady said merrily. Hello Aunt Ma, this is assigned to me by the school. Lin Qing has said. So it was old Wang who transferred this house to the school and the school allocated it? Aunt Ma said. Without waiting for Lin Qing he's answer, it's better to transfer it. Save himself from seeing those problematic people. What problematic people? Lin Qing, he asked. She recalled what Uncle Wang had said before and lowered his voice, is it the next door's Zhang family? That's right, it's the old Zhang's family. Aunt Ma lowered her voice and whispered, this old Zhang family is horrible ones. Back then, their relationship with Wang family was very strong, however, in a blink, they reported Wang family. They ruined old Wang. Lin Qing, he internally remarked, no wonder Uncle Wang, who got an open-minded personality, warned her in advance. What do you teach at school? Aunt Ma asked. English. Lin Qing, he replied. Teaching English at such a young age. You look about twenty-five, right? Is that young lad your brother? Aunt Ma said. That's my son. Lin Qing, he laughed, Auntie, I'm almost forty. It was still early for forty, but it didn't affect her bragging. Forty? Madam was shocked, I thought you're unmarried? That young man is your son? I thought he's your younger brother. I'm really almost forty. There's no mistake, it's my son. Don't look at his size. He is only fifteen this year. Lin Qing, he maintained, there are two younger ones back at home. Once I settle down here, they will follow my man over. I'll be neighbors with you in the future, Aunt Ma. Relatives in the distance aren't as good as nearby neighbors, so Aunt Ma, please take care of us. Don't underestimate these old ladies. They have first-hand information on the entire area, so it was necessary to get along with them. Of course. Your son is really energetic. Aunt Ma was full of smiles. His father used to be a soldier. He's just like his father, quite a build. Lin Qing, he said modestly. That's really good. Aunt Ma nodded and whispered, Teacher Lin, don't interact with old Zhang family from next door. In our area, their family's reputation is stinky. I understand. I was able to get the place because of Uncle Wang's special care. Otherwise, he wouldn't want to transfer. How can I possibly get along with them? Lin Qing, he declared outright. It seems that you and old Wang are truly on good terms. Aunt Ma smiled. Then she stuffed Lin Qing he with two tomatoes and went back. Lin Qing, he didn't eat yet. Her hands were dirty. She washed her hands, closed the door, and then returned to school and shared one with Wang Li. Wang Li said, why do I realize that you don't desire meat? And only want these? It's healthy. Lin Qing, he answered. There were a lot of tomatoes stored in her space this year. They were reserved for winter. There were no fruits in winter. And unlike the southern part, where it was like spring all seasons, here was very dry. I haven't been to your house yet. Let's go and take a look tomorrow? Wang Li said. All right. Go shopping with me tomorrow. It's a pity not to use free labor. Lin Qing, he smiled. You still mention this. You didn't call me when you cleaned up the house. Wang Li responded in mock anger. 
Chapter 275 Bad intention, the place is only that big. It only takes my son and I some effort. Lin Qing, he smilingly answered. The next day, she went to buy things with Wang Li. Then a whole set of pinewood furniture was organized. Pinewood cabinets, pinewood desks, and chairs. In the past, these would be severely cracked down on. But now, no one cared about that. Even the price wasn't very expensive. A complete set cost almost 30 yuan. Naturally, with so many items, it had to be delivered to the door. She requested two young men to bring it up. There were two rooms in this house. She got them to carry into the rooms and arranged properly. Same for the chairs and tables in the living room. When it was over, Lin Qing, he gave them two dimes each for the hard work, this is for you too. You don't need to hand it in, to your company. I've troubled you. Both young men were very happy. They thanked her, and went back. Although Wang Li came to buy things with her, she was more like an accompaniment. She remarked, you have everything sorted for the rooms. Yes, fully set up. Lin Qing, he said in a good mood. A large bed, table, cabinet, as well as small enamel pots and bowls were basically prepared. It was ready to move in now. Do you want to send a telegram back to let them move in? Seeing her like this, Wang Li teased. Lin Qing, he rolled her eyes in amusement. Although everything had been set up, there was no plan to let Zhou Qingbai come yet. Let him finish this year. Afterward, he won't continue and come here to be with her. To be honest, Lin Qing, he was reluctant to let Zhou Qingbai do farm work in their hometown. Like extremely reluctant. It wasn't easy to do farm work, especially day after day. Zhou Qingbai never complained, but Lin Qing, he knew the man had it hard. She couldn't help him. But the least she could do was manage the meals properly for him. Even if she got grumbled by others for wasting all of Zhou Qingbai's earning, she didn't care. Very few people could live their lives without caring about others' eyes. Well, Lin Qing, he happened to be one of them. There was nothing that can't be thought through. How many years does a person have in their life? The first 15 years were basically ignorantly passed. After the age of 40 or 50, the body began to decline again. During life in the middle, they have to bear the pressure of studying, working, getting married, raising children, etc. Adding this up, how much time was there? In a short life, there was really no need to care so much. Live your life well, then you will succeed. This was Lin Qing, he's very clear outlook on life. She had never wavered. Lin Qing, he didn't know that she was the kind to spoil her husband. But after meeting Zhou Qing Bai, she dove right into it. Don't know when it started, doting her own man became her habit. Lin Qing, he smiled when thinking of the man back at home. Wang Li said, I have to come over here for a meal frequently in the future. Come then. I will definitely let you go back holding your stomach. Lin Qing, he joked. Wang Li laughed. She was also envious, and said, you got a place to live and a position in the school. Everything will be smooth after this. Once she moves her household registration over, she will be a Beijing citizen, from now on. If you have summer and winter vacations in the future and come over to travel and have fun, look for me. I will always arrange things for you. Lin Qing, he stated. Wang Li smiled and said, same for my hometown. It is a place where cherries are rich. You have to go to our side. I'll manage the food and accommodation. The two chatted and laughed for a bit and then locked the door and went back to school. As for this side, Lin Qing, he would send Zhou Kai over to clean up every few days. She had gave Zhou Kai a head up. There was old Zhang family next door. They once reported Uncle Wang for doing bad things. Better not socialize with them. Zhou Kai took note. However, even if Zhou Kai didn't provoke others, they may not stay settled. The neighboring old Madame Zhang was hanging clothes. She smiled kindly at Zhou Kai, are you really teacher Lin's son? 
I couldn't tell at all. I thought you were siblings. Zhou Kai replied casually, my mother looks young. Aunt Ma came out with a vegetable basket and called, Xiao Kai, I have two extra tomatoes. Come and eat them. Okay, I just happen to be a little thirsty. Zhou Kai originally wanted to say no. But seeing Aunt Ma winking and directed her glance at old Madame Zhang, who was drying her clothes, he changed his response. And walked over. Aunt Ma whispered, Xiao Kai, don't pay attention to her. Her family has been asking around about your family recently. Why are they inquiring? Zhou Kai asked in puzzlement. Why else? Her family has been eyeing on old Wang's house for a long time ago. Aunt Ma harumphed. Wasn't it because they wanted to take over old Wang's place, they maliciously took action? At that time, there were many people who went over to beg for leniency. However, it was too strict and interceding was useless. So old Zhang family succeeded. But later reform happened and he returned. Even when she sharpened her brain, she won't get this house. Zhou Kai said calmly when he heard this. That right. It's all formal procedures. Still, that family is a bad bunch. Her two daughters who were sent away had returned two days ago. Aunt Ma continued. Zhou Kai nodded without care. He didn't take it seriously. Aunt Ma educated in amusement, you fool, they are targeting you, don't you know? Targeting me? Zhou Kai was really taken aback now, I'm only 15. That's right. Don't look at his height of 1.86 meters, but he was really only 15. Still a good bit away from becoming an adult at 18. Aunt Ma laughed. At such a large age, she hoped the best for such an energetic young man, her youngest daughter is 18 years old. As the saying goes, marrying a girl who is three older is a fortune. Granny Ma, say no more. Zhou Kai uttered in shock. Aunt Ma couldn't stop laughing. Still, she got back to the topic and preached, her family kept on asking about you and your mother. Apart from targeting a house plan, I guess they have their ideas on for you. So aunt called you over to specifically let you know. If she tells you to enter their house to help with something, you can't go in. Otherwise, you won't be able to escape. Once the door closes, her shameless daughter will be able to stick on him. If this happens, it was impossible to not marry her. With others, it won't happen. However, with old Zhang family, it won't be surprising. Zhou Kai was dumbfounded. This matter challenged his norms. Okay, go back now. After Aunt Ma finished with the reminder, she smilingly said, let your mother come over another day. I have to chat with her. Okay. Zhou Kai returned as he snacked on tomatoes. First, he cleaned the room. Then he politely declined old Madame Zhang's invitation to go in to drink water and locked the door and went back. Zhou Kai, who went back, didn't see it. But Aunt Ma, who came out to collect her clothes, did. The 18-year-old girl from the old Zhang family ran out to watch Xiao Kai's back with a flushed face. Chapter 276 Checking out the shop, seeing her like that, Aunt Ma turned around and returned inside with a look of contempt. When Uncle Ma got off work in the evening, Aunt Ma murmured to him, this old Zhang really don't want skin or face. Xiao Kai is still a child, and they actually have ideas on him. He was indeed tall, but he was only 15 years old. In the eyes of Aunt Ma, a 50-something old lady, he was a kid. How do you know that they are aiming for Xiao Kai? Uncle Ma said. Have to say, Lin Qing He and her son were also really popular. Being a college student, which was a valuable asset at this time, was one reason. Another was that they both know how to socialize. When they came over, they both greet with smiles, especially Zhou Kai. Last time, when Uncle Ma came back, he, Kai, happened to bump into him as he was about to leave. Seeing him, Uncle Ma, coming back with a sack of corn, he directly helped him bring it. At that time, they haven't been acquainted yet. Only after moving it up, did they know they were neighbors. 
Therefore, Uncle Ma had a very good impression of Zhou Kai. I saw it with my own eyes. The youngest from old Zhang family watched Xiao Kai's back like they had something. Aunt Ma spat, her kind? Not worthy at all. When teacher Lin comes over, I have to tell her. Must get her to be on guard. She knew that Zhou Qingbai will be coming next year or so. What's more, old Zhang family got an addition of two more girls now. Was there any secret in this area? Gossip can spread all at once. Both of them came back from the countryside. The older one came back with a divorce. Although she had no children, she was pregnant once during the time in the countryside. At that time, she want married. If she hadn't made an escape, no to quickly pick out a kind man and not get reported, she would have to instantly got educated. Not a good thing either. As for the younger one. She heard that when she was in the countryside, she had a lot of matches and had a very good relationship with the community director. A discerning person would know what the relationship was when they saw it. Not a proper one. Why did she know so much? Was she the only one who went to the countryside? Every household had quotas. There's plenty. So how can they not know? And I must be kept on the two. Lin Qing, he still didn't know about this. Recently, the school held an English-speaking competition, there were so many things to do. When she was finished, it had entered into December. It was a bit cold at this time. Still, this winter was much warmer than last year. At this time last year, it was really cold. Like freezing to death according to the solar calendar, it was December and November on the lunar calendar. The weather was certainly getting colder and colder each day. Zhou Kai brought a food box over that day. Same old rule. He got chicken soup from his classmate's house and left half of it there. Mother, how about turning on our own stove? Zhou Kai asked. Let's talk about it when your father comes. It's just the two of us. Lin Qing, he rep led while drinking chicken soup. Zhou Kai didn't persist and said, I went to the house yesterday and took a look. When my father comes over, mother, you have to keep an eye on him. What's wrong? Lin Qing, he hadn't gone over for a long time. She sent her son to check and clean up. She didn't know about old Zhang family. It's old Zhang family that lives next door to us. Zhou Kai answered. Question mark. Lin Qing, he looked at him. I don't know how to explain. Mother, you'll know when you visit Granny Ma in your free time. Zhou Kai said. Two days ago, he saw the girls from old Zhang family who had returned to the city. Both the older one and the younger one. When they saw him, they greeted him. He didn't say anything. A nod was sufficient. The older one had sent a bun to him to eat. Of course, Zhou Kai won't eat it. Still, Zhou Kai had a feeling that when his father comes, that woman will get close to his father. The reason for saying this was because Zhou Kai thought how his mother would give lectures in the future and he would be at school. It was only his father who would have nothing to do at home. Something will easily happen, right? Lin Qing, he glanced at him. So, she especially draped on a scarf and found a time to go over to Aunt Ma. She brought a bag of melon seeds for Aunt Ma. Teacher Lin, I haven't seen you for a while. Old Madame Zhang said with a smile. Lin Qing, he nodded in alienation. Then she ignored her, came over, and looked into Aunt Ma's door. Aunt Ma greeted and let her in. Old Madame Zhang's face was ugly. She snorted coldly, what is it? Just a teacher. What's there to be proud of? Lin Qing He, who entered the house with Aunt Ma, couldn't be bothered with her. She took the melon seeds and chattered away with Aunt Ma. Only then, Lin Qing He knew how excellent the old Zhang family was. They actually two daughters like this. Must admit, there was a slight risk. If her Qing Bai comes and stays at home, how easy it'll be for him to be targeted by the divorcee of the neighboring old Zhang family. No need to have doubt about this kind of person. They don't have anything like the lower limit. 
So Lin Ching, he came to find the library's Uncle Wang. When she came, Zhou Kai was also there. The old and the young were eating buns. Mother, you came too late. We finished the steamed buns. Zhou Kai said. Always coming over to eat your Uncle Wang's things for nothing. Aren't you ashamed? Lin Ching, he lectured. I bought it for uncle. Zhou Kai said. That's more like it. Lin Ching, he was pleased. Uncle Wang laughed, I'll invite you another day to eat instant boiled mutton, the most authentic one. Kai's father will come next year. Let him be the host. Lin Ching, he smiled. Then she asked, Uncle, do you know a shop in this area? The kind that wants to change hands? What do you want the shop for? Uncle Wang looked at her and asked. Kai's father is coming next year, right? There's no work arrangement for him, so I thought, let him open a shop and watch it. Lin Qing, he replied. The original plan was to let Zhou Qing buy to go to the school to open a school supply store. But there were no school supplies to sell this time. So after contemplating about it, she felt they should still open another shop to do some side business. Lin Qing, he noticed the emergence of self-employed this year. The number wasn't large, but after this year's trial, there will definitely be more self-employed next year. Lin Qing, he was planning to take action. Uncle Wang knew about the situation in the capital. Upon hearing this, he remarked, self-employed people aren't highly looked upon. However, if you're not afraid of being thought of low grade, I can help you ask. What's low grade about it? Not stealing or robbing. It's relying on our own hands to feed ourselves. Lin Qing, he cheerfully responded. Uncle Wang nodded, then leave it to me. Lin Qing, he knew that shops shouldn't be too difficult to buy at this period of time. However, she never expected that within two days, Uncle Wang would tell Zhou Kai to relay to her to have a look in the evening. Lin Qing, he was in joy. In the evening, she brought a vegetable basket and then followed her eldest son to find Uncle Wang. Then they came to see this shop together. Chapter 277 The first shop Lin Qing, he thought this was just a simple shop. But when she came over, she realized that this shop was a duplex kind. In other words, there was a second floor. Business happened on the first floor, while the second floor was basically for living. This was simply beyond Lin Qing, he's expectation. Zhou Kai examined it. He loved it but still had some hesitation, such a shop must cost a lot of money. That side's opening price, with transfer fee, is 3,000. Uncle Wang said. 3,000? Lin Qing, he's tone, held some surprise. Uncle Wang thought she found it too expensive and continued, originally it was 3,200. Looking upon my face, it was reduced by 200. With its location and being a duplex, it can't go any lower. Zhou Kai was disappointed when he heard this, and said, Mother, let's change. He was fond of this place, but it was too expensive. 3,000 yuan for such a house. What change? This property is great. Lin Qing, he refuted in displeasure. She knew Uncle Wang had misunderstood her meaning, and hurriedly said, Uncle Wang, when will the landlord be free? If both parties have no objection, then let's find a time to settle the transfer. 3,000 yuan, ah. Uh. 3,000 yuan, to buy a duplex building in such an area. Lin Qing, he felt that this was an extremely great bargain. If it's in the later generations, forget about getting such a building with a piece of land for 3,000. One can only buy about one square meter of living area in the county city. You're willing to buy it? Uncle Wang chuckled when he heard this. Among several properties, he was also most satisfied with this one. The location was great as well as being close to the market. If one wants to do business, such a place was perfect. That's why he brought them here, for a look. Willing. Uncle, you found me such a good one, how can I not be happy? Lin Qing, he grinned. This shop was almost 80 square meters. 
It's not especially spacious, but it was definitely not small either. The most important thing was that there was a second floor. That 3000 won't be a loss at all. After arranging the transfer time for tomorrow morning, Lin Qing, he took Zhou Kai back to school. Zhou Kai asked on the way back, Mother, do we have so much money? You don't have to worry about money. Lin Qing, he waved her hand. Zhou Kai laughed. Seeing him like this, Lin Qing, he gave him a disgruntled glance, what are you laughing for? Stinky brat, if you dare to leave some black stain and ruin your future, see if I'll clean you up. This was a disguised admission. Zhou Kai said, I know. Study hard. These matters are all your parents' affairs. You don't need to worry about it. If not, I'll really worry, understand? Lin Qing, he warned. I know, I know. Seeing her going on and on again, Zhou Kai quickly stated. Lin Qing, he waved her hand to dismiss him away. The next day she came to the Housing Management Bureau with her household registration to hand over the documents along with the house owner. Not a single cent was short from the 3,000 yuan. Uncle Wang originally wanted to ask if she wanted to borrow from him or something. To his surprise, she really had it and had the ability to take it out. After getting the property certificate, it went without saying how Lin Qinghe's mood was. She couldn't be any more excited than this. She owned a property in the capital. In a place like the capital where later generations are soaring. Uncle Wang looked at her joyful expression and smiled, what business are you planning to do? This has to be discussed with Kai's father. Uncle, do you have any good suggestions? Lin Qing, he asked. Open a dumpling shop. Uncle Wang did give a suggestion. Lin Qing, he was stunned for a moment, and then laughed out, Uncle, have you heard it from De Hua that his father can only make dumplings? Making dumplings isn't a bad choice. Uncle Wang said seriously. Lin Qing, he pondered on it seriously. A side business wasn't easy. But if it's dumplings, it was really no problem. After all, whether it was her or Zhou Qing Bai, they both knew how to. After all, the technical skills weren't high. At this stage, as long as one did business, they were basically making money. It didn't matter what they did. So Lin Qing, he said, when I go back this winter vacation, I will tell him. Because of this shop, Lin Qing, he truly longed to go home. In the following days, it was getting colder day by day. The hot water bottle that Zhou Qing Bai bought came in handy. It was very cozy to carry it in her embrace. It's extremely freezing, Wang Li said. Lin Qing, he felt it was fine since she had a hot water bottle and asked, Will you go back this year? I won't return this year. There are only so many days. Better save some fares. Wang Li responded. The winter vacation time was only 20 days. It took up a few days on the journey over and back. Wang Li didn't plan to go back last year. So it'll be the same this year. Lin Qing, he didn't say anything. Naturally, she'll go back. On December 20th of the lunar calendar, she officially got her break. Zhou Kai didn't plan to go back. Lin Qing, he let him be. She left him with fifty dollars. Zhou Kai grinned and said, Mother, I won't be polite to you. His mother was worthy of being a profiteer. Each time, she was extraordinarily generous. Join your classmates' family for New Year's dinner. Lin Qing, he told to him. One can't be absent from their own family's New Year's dinner. It was permitted for other people to join their own family. Of course, the relationship was generally great. Lin Qing, he knew that her eldest son had a strong relationship with his classmate, so she didn't care. I know. Zhou Kai responded. He'll bring a roast duck and a chicken over and wait to eat. Lin Qing, he didn't bother with him and caught the ride directly to High City. At the end of 1979 this year, a particularly prosperous scene will appear in High City. She remembered that when she came over in summer, she already witnessed some wearing skirts. 
Unexpectedly, she can already see people wearing colorful dresses in the winter. Have to say, the unrestricted spring was really here. Lin Ching, he stuck to her old rules. This time she bought a batch of clothes, electric fans, watches, radios, etc., again. She'll get a sum of money when exchanging hands. Not too much time was delayed as she was already familiar with the place. She arrived in the morning and returned by bus in the evening. It was pretty late when she arrived at the municipal city. Lin Ching, he wasn't afraid. After all, it hadn't reached the time when safety was a problem yet. If she left it till next year, she wouldn't dare to. Starting next year, she plans to go down south with her family, Ching Bai, to buy goods. She set aside those that were useful and sold the rest. She found someone in the municipal city to sell off the new clothes that she brought back. They were easy to sell out. As for Xin Yu's side, forget. Let's just say she hadn't gone over this year, they weren't strangers, so can't do this every year. She rested in the municipal city for one night. Early the next day, she caught the ride back to the county city. Chapter 278 Leave after the new year, when she reached the county city, she headed to Zhou Xiaomei's place. Only then she found out Zhou Xiaomei had already given birth. She gave birth to a girl, who was already past, two months old. Lin Qing, he felt admiration, you're capable in giving birth. Two sons, and two daughters. This was a perfect balance. Zhou Xiaomei was nurtured very well, by Su De Lin. Her whole body was round and plump. She pursed her lips in mirth, this daughter is very noisy. More troublesome than the previous three. The words sounded full of disdain, but Zhou Xiaomei's eyebrows displayed full of joy. This came from someone who said she only wanted one daughter. Now she got four. Su De Lin hadn't got his holiday yet. When he got home from work at noon, he saw Lin Qing, he, and happily called out, Why, why did, you cook? It was almost 11.50 when he came back. Zhou Xiaomei didn't know how to cook, so she just waited for Su De Lin to come back. Su De Lin didn't complain at all. After so many years, it was the honest truth that Zhou Xiaomei really married the right person in this life. Since she came over, Lin Qing, he might as well do it. It's not a large matter. Lin Qing, he smiled and said, I have to congratulate you, brother-in-law. You become a dad again. Su De Lin had a giant grin on his face. His parents only gave birth to him. He was lonely since childhood. When it was his turn, he had two sons and two daughters. Life couldn't be more satisfying. After lunch, Lin Qing, he took out a roast duck, which was wrapped in greased paper, from the bag. Fourth sister-in-law, why didn't you take it out at lunch, Zhou Xiaomei asked. If I want to eat, I can easily get some. The ones in the bags are for other people. Lin Qing, he replied. She also gave some snacks and candies to the children. Then she put the package on the back of the bicycle, which she let Su De Lin tied up and went home. As for Zhou Xiaomei, she hadn't got time to go back to her maternal family this year. The baby was still so small. Su De Lin alone was sufficient for the family visitations. When Lin Qing, he returned home, Zhou Qingbai wasn't at home. He and third brother Lin went hunting pheasants and rabbits. Mother Zhou and San Hua were at home. Erwa had joined his father. Qingbai was going over the day before yesterday. But thinking that you'll be coming back, he didn't go. And waited at home instead. He waited yesterday. Since you didn't come back, he went out today. Now you're actually back. Mother Zhou was amused. Lin Qing, he found it funny as well. Mother, are you hungry? I will make you a bowl of dumplings? Sanwa asked. No need. Just came back from your youngest aunt's house. Lin Qing, he answered. Then she began to assign tasks, send these roast ducks to your three uncles. There were also some for eldest sister and second sister. However, they were quite a distance away. Once Erwa comes back, she'll let Erwa deliver them. 
As for other neighbors, there was no need to gift. That there are no worries about unfair distribution. No matter how much there, it'll never be enough to share. No one will say anything if it was only for families. Why are you buying it back every year? Mother Zhou uttered in distress, for the money. It's only once a year. Treat it as the joy of reunion. Lin Qing, he said. Mother Zhou didn't say any more and changed the topic, Qing Bai killed two ducks yesterday. They are frozen in the backyard. Just waiting for you to come back to handle them. All right. I'll stew one tonight. The rest will be chopped, marinated, and fried. Lin Qing, he nodded. She slept well last night, so she wasn't tired. She went over to take a look at the duck and started simmering it. Eldest sister and the others came over while the duck was being stewed. After talking for a while, they went back. When they got back, they sent their kids to bring the peeled peanuts and sesame seeds. Lin Qing, he didn't hold back. Mother, how is the harvest in the village this year? Lin Qing, he asked, while eating cakes. There were dumplings, steamed buns, and mantu at home. Just need to steam it in the pot or cook it in the pot. Very convenient. Tonight, they will have the old duck soup with mantu. It was no problem to add a scrambled egg. It wasn't very hectic at the moment, so she went to talk with Mother Zhou. Mother Zhou also had a piece of hibiscus cake in her hand, and said, This year's harvest is quite good. Will the Wa come back this year? He said that the holiday period is too short and he just stayed there. Leave him be. Lin Qing, he said, Mother, forget it this year. After New Year, I plan to take Qing Bai to the capital. You and father don't need to work in the field. If you want food, you can buy it directly with the team. Mother Zhou froze a second, take Qing Bai to the capital after the New Year? She knew that her youngest son was going to go with his wife, but not this early. We have a teacher who is pregnant this year, so I graduated early. I'm now a teacher at the school. This year, I can bring Qing Bai over and move our household registration with the certificate given at that side and settle down on the way. Lin Qing, he explained. Then accommodation. The school arranged a place for me. De Wa and I already went to clean up. All the furniture is prepared. Although it's not spacious, it's no problem for a family to live in. Lin Qing, he assured. The original place was to leave Er Hua and Sand Hua behind. On the second thought, since Zhou Qing Bai is going on, she planned to move their family over this year. Once the household registration is moved over, Er Hua and San Hua can simply study in the capital. Mother Zhou knew what she meant, but once the father and sons go over, they'll have to rely on you for feeding the family. Seeing her daughter-in-law's expression, her voice wavered. I rented a shop over there. I plan to get Qing Bai to sell dumplings. Don't let others know about this yet. Just say that I'm working at school and usually busy on weekdays. Since the children are brought over and they have to eat. Qing Bai went over to cook for the children. Lin Qing, he responded. She was being cautious and said that it was rented. She would have to explain a lot if she said bought. So forget it, just say rented. Okay. What else could Mother Zhou say? She didn't have any objections. Fort's wife was too capable and everything was neatly arranged. However, renting a shop. Don't know if it'll make a loss? Mother Zhou couldn't help but said. She had heard that there were people in the city who have opened a shop. Out of the whole city, there was only one family. Everyone knew about it. So they knew that they can open a shop now. This wasn't the important part. The main focus was whether it will make a loss or not. What loss can there be? It's just selling dumplings. Those who don't want to make their own can order a bowl. Give a sufficient amount and it won't go too badly. Lin Qing, he said. Although it's not a respectable work, we can put that aside. Can't let Old Fourth go over and eat free meals. Mother Zhou nodded. Lin Qing, he didn't correct her either. 
At this time, starting one's own business was certainly less respectable than having employment in a company. Still, as long as Zhou Qingbai didn't mind, it was fine. You guys are leaving after the new year, ah. Uh. Mother Zhou lightly sighed. Once our side settles down, I will pick you and father up then. Lin Qing, he suit. Chapter 279 Work hard to earn money Mother Zhou obviously wanted to go. She grinned and said, wait until you are settled and then discuss. Let's see if us two old things can help. If there is, we will go. They can't go over to cause trouble. Lin Qing, he didn't say anything. It was a bit early to say this now. Wait until later, and then decide. Zhou Qingbai came back with Er Hua in the evening. The father and son brought back two rabbits and five pheasants. Lin Qing, he saw that third brother Lin hadn't come, and asked, Have your uncle gone far? Not yet. We just separated. Erwa confirmed. Bring this roast duck to your uncle. Lin Qing. He handed him the roast duck which had been wrapped in oil paper and ordered. As for eldest sister and second sister, they'll handle it tomorrow. Okay. Erwa hopped on the bicycle and made a chase. Only then, Lin Qing, he looked at Zhou Qingbai. Zhou Qingbai was also examining his wife. Father, have you not seen enough? You have been looking since you came back. Sanwa teased. I think you are full. Want to taste bamboo stick fried flesh? Lin Qing, he swept a glance at him. Sanwa giggled and then went to boil the water to clean the fur. Lin Qing, he brewed a cup of honey water for Zhou Qing Bai to drink first. There were a few cans of honey in her space. All were reserved for drinking in winter. It was too dry, so they got to stay hydrated. Waited for you, and you haven't returned. After drinking the honey water, Zhou Qing Bai looked at her and said. "N, I heard from mother. The moment you go out, I came back. Gave you a surprise. Lin Qing, he laughed. The corner of Zhou Qing Bai's mouth raised slightly. Lin Qing, he pulled him into the room and then showed him the property certificate, I got it settled. Once this year is over, our family will move. Tomorrow, go find the school head to arrange the transfer certificate for the two boys. Leave once the new year is over? Zhou Qing Bai dumbly stared at the property certificate and then turned to his wife. I didn't expect that I would graduate so soon. The plan couldn't keep up with the changes. Still, it's all a good thing. Lin Qing, he responded, the house we'll live in had been cleaned up by me and our eldest son. After this year is over, shall we leave? Then I will go and settled all the required documents tomorrow. Zhou Qingbai said after hearing this. Lin Qing, he smiled and looked at him, aren't you worried about going to that side? Not worried. I will watch the shop. Zhou Qingbai seriously vowed. I plan to let you sell dumplings, so you have to practice at home during the new year. Lin Qing, he said. Okay. Zhou Qingbai breathed a sigh of relief. Selling dumplings was within his ability. Still, practicing was a must this year. So starting the next day, Zhou Qingbai started cooking after he sorted out the required documents. Nothing else, just rolling out the dumpling skin, chopping up the stuffing, wrapping it up, and then cooking the dumplings. He had completely perfected it. In the following period, the whole family came face to face with dumplings. Lin Qing, he had eaten until she was afraid. However, seeing her Qing by looking very serious, she tacitly resigned. In fact, it was just a dumpling shop. The reason why this shop was opened was that she was afraid that he'll be extremely bored once he moved there. A man can get tired, but he can't be too idle. If he was too idle, he will lose confidence in himself. That's why such a shop came into place these days, Zhou Qingbai tried a lot of dumplings. Cabbage, mushrooms, etc. which were all good fillings. Mince beef, mince lamb and mince pork as well. However, the materials here were a bit lacking. Beef and lamb were rare. 
The most eaten was pork stuffing. Originally, Lin Qing, he had a relaxed mentality. But now she saw her Qing Bai's perseverance, she didn't dare to be sloppy. After all, this counted as his first career after being discharged from the army, right? Lin Qing, he felt that he should be encouraged. So she bombarded prevailing words at Zhou Qing Bai so hard that Zhou Qing Bai's eyebrows carried mirth. It was nearly the new year. Only then, Zhou Qing Bai didn't continue to make dumplings. It was because he had found a lot of confidence from his wife during this period. Moreover, his parents and two sons also said that it was delicious. It won't badly then. Everyone was relieved. Although dumplings were good stuff, they can't stand to eat them every day. They were really tired of them. Lin Qing, he made cornmeal mantu. Then she chopped green onions and fried two pheasants and cooked a pot of radish and bone soup. Such a combination tasted delicious. At night, the lights were still lit in Lin Qing, he and Zhou Qing Bai's room. Lin Qing, he was reading a book while snacking on tomatoes. Zhou Qing Bai also had a tomato in his hand. Once you open the shop in the future, let's store up more fruits and vegetables when they are plentiful and keep it for dumpling filling in winter. It will be very fresh to eat. Lin Qing, he said. No need. Just follow everyone else. Zhou Qing Bai stated. Lin Qing, he smiled and looked at him, when the South shipments arrived and growing veg in greenhouse become a thing, there will be no worries. I won't need to use my space then. Zhou Qing Bai responded, save it for our own family. It was still that reason. He didn't want to expose any suspicion of his wife's magical thing. All right. Lin Qing, he obediently agreed. Seeing that Zhou Qingbai had finished eating, she took another one out for him, it's too dry today. Eat one more. Zhou Qingbai liked eating them. Knowing that she had saved a lot of it, he didn't hold back. After eating the tomatoes, he himself took a notebook out to jot down his thoughts. Once it was about time, the two went to bed. Xiaomei gave birth to another girl. Lin Qing, he emotionally mentioned after lying down. Life was unpredictable. This little sister-in-law Zhou Xiaomei was really amazing. She used to be a sweet young girl. But it was no wonder why Zhou Xiaomei was so willing to give birth to so many children. Su De Lin's treatment toward her was impeccable. N. De Lin had come to announce the good news. Zhou Qingbai responded. De Hua, that stinky brat didn't come back this year. So let's make up for it when we go to the capital. Lin Qing, he said. Zhou Qingbai had no objection either. He was rubbing his wife's waist. Lin Qing, he was very comfortable and said, Qingbai, I'm overjoyed that this shop was bought. Buy more in the future. Zhou Qingbai replied. He heard what she said. The property in the capital will be scarily expensive in the future. Still, he was a little bit astonished when he heard it. He couldn't imagine it. So taking advantage of the cheap price, they have to buy a few more first. Lin Qing, he grinned and said, I do want to buy more. That's why we have to make a lot of money. After coming back from High City, she made a thousand or so profit. When it came to making money, there was really no better way to make money than reselling these things. The risk was high. But no matter in which era, courageously charging toward the risk meant higher reward when won. Besides, she got a cheat, the space. N. Zhou Qingbai also seriously acknowledged. He wanted to work hard to earn money. Can't just let his wife take the whole burden. Chapter 280 Envy Family's New Year Dinner was on December 31, 1979. In fact, the other three branches were interested in getting together for the meal. However, Lin Qing, he declined. She expressed that everyone can eat their own food. Dewa hadn't come back this year. Without full attendance, they might as well forget it. As for the matter of Zhou Qing Bai and the boys set off to the capital after New Year, it hadn't been announced yet. 
On New Year's Eve, when she came to the old Joe's house to find her sisters-in-law for some conservation, Lin Ching, he mentioned it. The three sisters-in-law were shocked. Huh? After New Year, fourth brother will move to the capital along with Air Wa and Sand Wa. What will happen to your home here? Eldest sister-in-law uttered in a daze. Father and mother are here. They will move to our place in the future. Lin Ching, he answered. Father Zhou and Mother Zhou had no objection. Going over, they'll be in a spacious house. Also, there were so many chickens and ducks in the backyard. Once we're gone, keep an eye out on father and mother for me, sisters-in-law. The elderly are high in age. They should stop doing farm work. Lin Ching, he continued. As for old age support, how it was before was how it'll be now. Ever since the family separation, there had been no conflict within old Zhou family about father Zhou and mother Zhou's old age care. Completely different from other families who often fought over this matter. That's not a matter at all. About fourth brother and the boys moving to the capital. What's the story with the accommodation and household registration, said third sister-in-law. I'm employed by the school this year and now become an English teacher at Bay University. The school has assigned me a place that is sufficient to live in. The household registration is much simpler. My school unit will help get it accepted. There is no problem. Lin Ching, he smilingly assured. Her family's Ching Bai had completed gathered all the necessary documents for the relocation of the household registration. The family can simply settle down once they reach the capital. Hearing this had eldest sister-in-law, second sister-in-law, and third sister-in-law stunned. Fourth's wife was too competent. Work, household registration, and so on were all sorted. And fourth brother's work? Is it settled? asked second sister-in-law. I rented a shop for Ching Bai over there. At that time, he'll be self-employed and sell dumplings. Lin Ching, he also answered. Be self-employed? Fourth brother is willing? Third sister-in-law uttered in surprise. Why would he be unwilling? It's also relying on his hands to make money. Don't think about it so much. There is no shame in doing a business. Only when one doesn't have food to eat and go steal and cheat that it would be ashamed. Lin Ching, he said. Ching, he, have you received any news from the capital? Will there be arrests in the future? Eldest sister-in-law asked. I heard mother mention that you have raised a lot of chickens. Lin Ching, he smilingly responded I'm raising more than a dozen. Eldest sister-in-law nodded. Wait until next spring. You can grab two and find a place to squat then. Lin Ching he said, if someone investigates, you can just say that someone in the family is in postnatal confinement and go to Xiao Mei's house. If no one checks, then go to the entrance of the hospital and have a look. Eldest sister-in-law was a little scared, this, what to do if I get caught? The one in bureau is Ching Bai's comrade in arms. If anything goes wrong, you can just bring out Ching Bai's name. Lin Ching, he suit. After today, it'll be 80. 1980. A brand new year. The spring breeze is shining on the earth and the spring flowers are blooming. There'll be no need for a letter of introduction when entering the city. No one cared about it. What crime could carrying two chickens be? It will get better and better in the future. Many people in the capital are doing business. Lin Ching, he said. A lot of people in the capital do business? Eldest sister-in-law immediately zoned in. Second sister-in-law and third sister-in-law stared at Lin Ching he. If not, do you think I will let Ching Bai be a self-employed? Lin Ching, he looked at them. Lin Ching, he didn't continue on this topic. She had said everything that should be said. As for whether they want to taste the sweetness, it was up to them. Everything in the city required money. And the green in the countryside wasn't worth much right. But there were some people willing to buy it when transported to the city. However, Lin Ching, he stopped at bringing up this business. 
she had stated there was no problem. If they didn't want to do it, it wasn't like she could force them to. Erwa and San Wa will go over there to study. Don't know if they'll get used to it or not, remarked third sister-in-law Er Wa will only be in the second semester of year one of high school in the next semester. Still early. As for San Wa. Maybe the education system will be reformed when it's his turn. Lin Qing, he didn't pay it any heed. She had forgotten when year three began to appear in junior high school and high school systems. It was around the middle of the 80s though. This semester, San Hua was just beginning the second semester of junior high's first year. Too early. On the other hand, she will keep an eye on Er Hua. Plus they got the capital's household registration. He can get some points deduction. So he'll at least get admitted. Third sister-in-law talked about Wu Ni's results, it always can't climb up. Now that Er Hua is gone, she got no one to ask. There are so many teachers in the school. As long as she studies hard, she can make up for her failures with diligence. Lin Qing, he said. Zhou Yang and Wu and I didn't come to her for supplementary classes again. If they didn't understand, they can bring it over to ask and revise a bit while they were at it. The supplementary classes were over. Lin Qing, he had to study too. However, Lin Qing, he had to admit that the two's grades were indeed difficult to achieve any higher. She had taught the learning methods. At least, their grades remained hovering in the middle. But it was sufficient to get into high school. The entrance exam was next year. As for high school, it was all up to them. Generally speaking, as long as they work hard and persevere, they won't do badly. By the way, I wonder if youngest sister has space for Wu and I and Yang Yang for when they go to study in the future, asked third sister-in-law. Lin Qing, he answered on behalf of Zhou Xiaomei right away, there are four children over there now. They're all still young and so noisy. If the two of them live there, what to do if they got disturbed? School is the most important thing. I think it is better to arrange for living on campus. But it's fine to let their uncle, De Lin, invite them for a meal once in a while. Dot. Eldest sister-in-law didn't plan to let Yang Yang go over to Xiaomei's place. It was third sister-in-law who wanted her daughter to live there. Now that she heard Lin Qingyi's words, she felt that it made sense. Lin Qing, he changed the subject and chatted with second sister-in-law, Xia Xia has grown a lot taller and appeared more energetic this year. Is he faring well at that side? The stinky boy came back and said that the food over there was especially great. Guaranteed to fill the stomach. Second sister-in-law said with a smile on her face. He's currently developing. Better not eat his master poor. Lin Qing, he joked. Won't eat till poor. The business there is doing wonderful. It's just Xia Xia is still working as an apprentice. Second sister-in-law wanted her son to be hands-on right away. Take it slowly. The rules over there are all the same everywhere. Lin Qing, he responded. As Lin Qing, he chatted with her sisters-in-law here, Zhou Qing Bai was talking with his brothers over there. After finding out about moving the household registration and become a citizen of the capital after the new year, the three brothers all held an expression of envy. Can support us, completed novel house in link below clip. Thank you for come in and love the sharing story.